Yeah, are we live? What the fuck? Okay. We are live now. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, don't mind my uh, shitty ass fucking internet, dude. It's uh, at and is being fucking AIDS, but hopefully it doesn't go out again. All right, what were we talking about? I don't even know. All right, ready to recap. Yo, let's get to it. Let's get to it then. Okay. Dude, I threw up a bunch. I still have that throw up in my in the bucket, actually. <laughs> I never I never fully dumped in the bucket full of throw up. It's just kind of uh, there. And it, I left it in my fucking bathroom. The whole bathroom smells like shit. And then I have it in the backyard now, just in the, in the bucket, dude. Fuck it. I don't know. My whole fucking room in my bathroom, it all smells like straight throw up, dude. Which is fine, but uh, I mean, fuck it. I don't know. All right, let's uh, see what we got here. So. Let me see here. Where was that list full of stuff that uh, I wanted to see? <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? Why did he... <laughs> okay, Harvey. All right, yeah, I don't know where that list is, but I think we'll find it eventually. Um, there was a post saying everything that I talked about, but I don't know where that, where that post went anymore. But, uh, okay, we'll just find it again, I guess. Let me see, I got scammed. I don't know what that means, Sam. Okay, let me see. Uh, Bone Clanks Appreciation Thread for doing real news. Sheeple want retards meat back or some shit, Lamau. Bone Clanks did a CX News today, and it was, uh, he was talking about everything that we talked about yesterday. Uh, he was going off this list. I don't know where that fucking list went. No fucking idea, but uh, it was... Uh, it was somewhere, dude. It's, uh, I don't know where the fuck it went. It's probably on the second page. Yeah, so, Bone Clinks, fucking, he was, you know, he was good on the, he was good on the CX News. Um, I did not cheat on my girlfriend. The fact that he said that really annoyed me. But other than that, um, you know, great CX News, Bone Clinks. That was nice. Uh, let me see. Pardon me, sir. Do you have any cock? That's Salmon Andy. I don't know why he's at a baseball stadium, but there he is. Um... Fuck DJ for saying all this weird shit. He threatened my girlfriend as well. He threatened me. Threatened my girlfriend. He said he was going to swat her. And he said he was going to uh, kill Broke Malone for $10,000. So, DJ is a piece of shit. I can't stand that annoying Jessie bitch. She's literally a slug creature that came out of the job of the Hutt's asshole. Can't believe she tried so hard in camera. Good save by SSJ yesterday. Dude. I know, dude, appreciation for Scott Steve Jobs for stopping me, making a, a huge mistake on accident, dude. That's all I have to say. Jesse was there, and she was ready to take full advantage of my drunk self. So thank you, Scott Steve Jobs, for not allowing her to fucking do that. Um, because obviously I was not in my... I was in a completely out-of-it state of mind. I didn't even know what the fuck I was doing. So, like, not a chance in hell. I'm suing you for defamation. Um... Sam, Sam, bro, you have a small penis, okay? I'm sober right now, and I'm just going to say it again and reiterate it. You have a small penis. Like, I've seen your fucking penis. Um, Hannah, I will take back, does not have a big clit, okay? It's just above average. That's something else. But, um... I didn't say I got sucked off by two guys. I don't know what you're talking about. I mean, I, it was, I mean, I, we all know those stories, but I didn't say it yesterday. You guys have known that for a while. Um, Evan, okay, so Evan, Evan, <laughs> uh, he said he was gonna sue me today for defamation. Uh, I think that's where Sam's memeing. Um, Evan, you can't sue me for defamation because I literally walked in the room and saw you sucking Sam's dick. All right, and there's no way for you to prove that that didn't happen to the judge. So go ahead, sue me. I would love to go to court because some guy, because you're having to prove that you didn't suck your roommate's dick uh, to a courtroom full of people. That I would love it. Like that would be the <laughs> that would be the best court case in history. Judge, I did not suck his dick for rent, and then the judge would be like, "Well, where's the proof?" And I'll be like, "Well, I saw it with my own two eyes." Switch the top post instead of hot to see the list. All right, hold on. Um, here's the link to the list. All right, the list. I, I looked at this today. I do not remember half the shit I said. Okay, 
Okay, so we'll just go by down it one by one. Apparently, there's like 30 things. First of all, how come you guys believe the stuff that I say yesterday, but you don't believe the stuff that I say usually? Like, what's the difference? I was just blacked out drunk. Like, I mean, I guess they say, you know, when you're drunk, it's like sober thoughts, but I don't know, bro. I think it's more along the lines of when I'm drunk, I just become more ridiculous in what I say. That's not necessarily sober thoughts. All right, but let's see what we got here. So, gay ice to start with. Let's see. I Okay. Paul says Harvey J has no content and is going to sodomize him. <laughs> Oh, so I didn't watch any of these links. I'm just like reading what the titles were. And, uh, okay. Okay. No, dude. Thanks, Mr. Poseidon. Hope you feel better soon. CX in the chat. Oh, That's not no. how defamation law works. The burden of proof is in you to prove it is true. Otherwise, he can absolutely shirt you. No, I mean, no, no. I'm going to show you what real content is, Harvey. Shit. Bro, we were still at the bar at this point. Like, I wasn't even dr well, I obviously was drunk. I didn't think I was drunk at this point. I didn't think I got drunk until I was like, really when I got home, dude, to be honest. Um, let me see if, what Harvey thinks about this clip. Because drunk people say the truth because you can't use your brain normally to keep up with the lies, so you always say the truth. And yes, you did say you got sucked off by two guys. You said SSJ. Oh, you're waiting. There you are. <laughs> Bro, I just want to say, before we watch this clip together, I did not mean anything I said. Anything. I did not mean anything I said. Literally. I didn't even know what I was saying, bro. It was just, you know, it was just coming out of my mouth, dude. It was, I was random ass shit. Right, right. How the fuck did you come out with us? You're too busy bringing Hennessy, bro. You're too busy drinking Hennessy, bro. You're too busy sitting in the room doing nothing, bro. Your content is literally drinking Hennessy, bro. Like I'm gonna fucking go in your room and I'm gonna show you what real content fucking is. And Tracks is gonna hold the camera. I'm gonna fuck your throat with the camera, dude. You're fucking retarded. I'm gonna show you what real content is, Harvey. Shit. How the fuck did you? Hennessy doesn't do that to you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so you want some other shit, man? I did drink two shots of Hennessy. Why do you treat Harvey like shit? Um, when you visited wait, hold on, Harvey. Do I treat you like, treat you like shit? In a way, you give him bean bags to sleep on and talk shit. I don't think I do. I, I, Harvey, I'm sorry if I ever treated you like shit last night. They're really comfortable bean bags. They were nice bean bags, but we got it. We got it. He has a uh, bed now. says, "Hey, Ice." Why are so many people sending me this clip and it's the clip of you saying that you're doing aim? Oh, no way. <laughs> and she goes, oh my God, he's such an idiot. LOL, I'm dying. Does that guy know that we didn't have anal sex? And then I said, wait, you and I didn't have sex using your best feature, the butt. And then she said, um, LOL, is ice okay? And then I said, yeah, he's fine. And she goes, okay, I didn't have sex with ice. Well, obviously, I was just trolling when I said that. Um, and then she, she said, can you tell stream? And I said, sure. Yeah, I was just trolling when I said that. I didn't fucking have anal sex with Cassandra, dude. That was actually my favorite thing you said the entire time. I actually believe you when you said Well, for the way she said, hold on, the way she said that was kind of weird. She's like, we didn't, I don't think we had anal sex. Like, how would you not, know, how would you not know that? Literally in text form, she said that. Sam, yeah, you 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 helped me a lot, dude, from what I saw. Why the fuck are you inviting Burger Planet? Sam and Andy. 
EBZ, and I re me to the streamer house. <laughs> Yeah, okay. I'm inviting RV Andy and Salmon Andy to Stream Rouse and all these Burger Planet. Uh, PD's a good guy. He's genuine. Dude, wait. You fucking. Come here. You fucking saved my butt, dude. You saved my butt. I didn't let. I'm not having a four way with Hannah and Sam. What the fuck? Um, dude, why, why did y'all let Jesse in the room? Clearly, I was out of my mind, and you know she was gonna try and, like, slug her way in on some shit. Yeah, she's a TTS machine. Okay, but listen, bro, like, I'm fucking drunk, and I'm laying in my bed, and I'm just grabbing people, dude. I'm That's just grabbing shit, and she's gonna let me grab her for sure, and make it look bad. I actually don't remember how she got in here. I don't think Because fire, fighting fire with fire is not okay. Um... Let me see, last time I hold your sick pocket and wipe your face, scumbag, no mention. Uh, yeah, no, Sam's a good guy. Sam really helped me out, too, obviously. Um, Thank you, Sam. No, yeah, when I grabbed fucking Jesse, I thought she was a bucket. <laughs> uh, well, like, you, I thought I, I was, like, about did. to throw up and I needed the bucket. And fucking, I don't know, I put my hand out and she just grabbed my hand. So I pulled her. I thought it was a bucket and I put my arm, like, around it. Like, that doesn't make any sense now when I say that. It, it makes zero fucking... Like, how do you how do you not know someone's not a bucket? But my fucking head was on the... Like, my head was in the in the mattress, dude. Like, I didn't know what I was doing, what I was looking at. It was just... I don't know. I was so blacked out drunk, I could not comprehend what was going on. Like I said, I couldn't even hear people talk. I heard noise, but I couldn't understand what people were saying. Um, really quickly, I just want to make an announcement. Hold on, wait. What's... Uh, don't worry. What's the announcement? Um, I feel like when we do things, we should do it together or whatever. And, um, I got your back. So, um, Evan, I also was there and witnessed you having to suck Sam off to pay your rent. <laughs> so, if you're getting sued, I need to get sued also. I saw it with my own two eyes. And, um... That's a fact. Uh, yeah, Evan said he was going to sue us today for defamation, but you can't sue for defamation if you actually did that. Like, he didn't want anybody to know. Yeah. Be, but I was going to keep it a secret, but since it's already out there, we might as well talk about it. If you didn't know Evan was gay, you really don't know. You've never seen a gay person before. Well, Petey, but if your gaydar was not going off on Evan the first time you saw him, then you're... you're probably of autism like bro evan's gay as a motherfucker homie my man wanted a nut don't lie i did not want a nut dude i didn't even i could not even get hard last night if i wanted to homie what are you saying um like evan's actually homosexual um believe it or not also guys there's something wrong if you're in hard times grab a dick <laughs> i think dicks solve a lot of a lot of problems so Call everyone one by one and Should apologize. Listen, Sam. No, Harvey's a good sport, dude. He's a Your good sport. No, my head was not in the bucket when I grabbed on her, but it was an accident. Like, it was. Why I are just, people spamming that I'm gay? I literally just said that dicks are fine. Um, yeah, no, Harvey's a good sport. I, uh, I, I did. Definitely was a little bit. Uh, I, don't know, I was roasting everyone yesterday, and I need to. Uh, I need to not do that. Yo, scuff. Um, can you grab my phone from Boulder Sedgwick? Please. Kimberly to have a four-way with Sam and Hannah. Don't lie, ice, don't lie, ice. Don't lie. Is that what I said? Okay. Um. No, I do not want to have a foursome with Sam and Hannah. I mean, because, well, I don't want anybody having sex with my girlfriend as, like, the priority here. Um, that's, like, honestly the main reason. I would never, like, I would have a threesome or a foursome with people if it didn't involve my girlfriend and I was single. I would not have sex with, like, I would not allow Sam to have sex with my girlfriend. And I'm sure he wouldn't let me have sex with Hannah either. Uh, so that's just weird. I mean, I would hope at least, right? You just fucking scammed Hannah. What happened? She donated to you. 
Bob was in his room playing RuneScape while you were puking. Harvey sucks. Wait, hold on, Sam. I think I saw you at LAX on Christmas Eve. We were sitting on the floor waiting for an American that's Airlines. That's funny. Wait, hello? Fag. Press control picked up Hanson Brandon who won't be home for a long time. What you mean? <laughs> well, I don't know what happened with Brandon. Apparently, got arrested. Um, wait, hold on. Let me pause this. Uh, yo, Sam. So, what? What did I say last night about you? Uh, you said obviously the the uh, Evan the Evan sucked my dick for rent thing. Um, uh, and then you said I had a small penis. Uh, you said that Hannah has a huge clit, and then you kept saying, "Oh, oh yeah, you guys know. were gonna show me her clit." Yeah, yeah, we tried to take you in the bathroom to show you. Um, no, why would you, no, why would you want to do that for? That's weird. To prove that she didn't have a big clip. Yeah, but that's then, weird. That's weird as fuck. Y'all are on some no, freaky shit. Y'all no, are really trying to have a threesome, aren't you? Night, last night, you Y'all are really trying to have a threesome, aren't you? Y'all are some on some freaky ass listen shit. This, Mr. Listen to this, Mister Poseidon. You were saying I want to. Uh, fuck you guys were gonna take I advantage of me when I'm drunk. Know, this is what you said. You said, I want to watch you and Hannah fuck when I'm fucking Kimberly. You want us both in the same room. I'm fucking Hannah and you're fucking Kimberly. I never said that. You said it so many times. Okay, well, I don't mean it. I mean, I actually, know. I mean, I would have... Okay, listen. I'm down. Act, I mean... I, I mean, here's the thing. As long as we don't touch each other's girlfriends like maybe yeah. we, that could be a possibility but like what's the point if we're just like watching we're each same, other we're in the same bed and i'm watching you fuck kimberly and you're watching me fuck hannah and we're like maybe we're high-fiving and shit i mean i don't know bro i don't i think that's just weird well you were down for it last night i feel like you just want to see me naked sam and fuck me um, no, nah, not really. I mean, I think it'd just be fun, honestly. Um, I mean, I, I mean, I could be, I mean, we'll have to talk about it, uh, all four of us, because, like, I don't know, dude. I, I mean, I might be down with it, but, like, I don't know, because we might need to, uh, like, I just feel like it would be weird. I don't fucking know, dude. Like, the only thing that makes it weird for me is that, like, I'm scared that I'll come, like, way before you, and then you're still going, and then what do me and Hannah do if I've already come? Like, do we just leave the room? I mean, yeah, basically. Alright, well, I have to just be on my top performance. Did you get offended by anything I said yesterday? Of course not. If you get actually triggered or offended by anything you say last night, then you're fucking retarded. Dude, I think some people got offended by what I said. I looked at my Twitter and people were offended, dude. They definitely did. They most definitely did. Who? I think Bree got offended. Yeah, a few people got offended. We know that already. Wait, who else got offended? Well, Evan was offended. Yeah, but Evan, okay, he's, he's, he's you know, he needs to come out, all right. Um, yeah, Bree was offended. Obviously, Cassandra was offended for texting you. Um, uh, well, she wasn't offended. She said she thought it was funny, but just wanted me to tell that everybody I'm it wasn't sure true. Kim- I'm sure Kimberly was offended by some things, too. Oh, yeah, she was, I did not wake up to a good morning. She was offended, <laughs> and I had to do some explaining for sure. Yeah, but but honestly, if you get offended by anything that happened last night, I mean, I mean, yeah, you were really drunk and like, I, you know, this is the thing. With you touching, like, the slug, in your defense, at one point, I... She took advantage down. of me! Yeah, on, 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 at one point, at one point, I pulled down my pants, and I was standing there just in my boxes, and you were just stroking up and down my leg, and you literally did not know you were touching me. Like, you had no idea. No, dude, I was fucking, like, I don't know, I was just, it just felt good. I don't know what I was touching, but it was just, it felt good, because like, I was so nauseous. Feeling shit was, like, keeping my mind off of the nauseousness, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, so, like, Honestly, like, I can see why Kimberly would feel some sort of way about the slug thing, but being there and witnessing you and, and, and seeing how you was, I know 100% like, you were just, you were just not really in your right mind, you know? 
No, I was watching clips. I was like, I grabbed your dick. I rubbed Scuff Steve Jobs' fucking head. Like, it's, yeah. I don't know. It's just weird shit, dude. Okay, Hannah, for Hannah's apology, she wants you to verbally say that you have never seen Hannah's Let vagina. me talk to her. Put her on the phone. All right, you have to call me back as a phone call. Okay. All right. I got to apologize to Hannah here. Hannah. Yes. Why is your clip so big? Oh. My God. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Hannah. You're sh I've never seen your fucking clip. I don't know why I said that. I was just trolling you. Okay, thank you. Oh, wait, are you mad? I've just been crying all day about it. Why? You've not been crying. You're bullshitting. Okay, I love you. Bye. Thank you. Hannah, Hannah, wait. Oh, what the fuck? Wait, is she like, mad? I want to ask Hannah if she's down to do the full way double sex thing. Of course she is. I mean, of, of course. Yeah, but but I think you need to do your rounds. Thank you for calling me, first of all. I think you need to move on to each part, party. I mean, you think I should call Evan and apologize? No, I don't know. Don't worry about it. Um, who else would I? Who else should I call then? You should definitely call Kimberly. Oh, I already, I already talked to her about all that. That was, <laughs> that was definitely uh, an off-stream conversation. <laughs> How many times have you been in the fucking doghouse already in this relationship? I mean, only twice. Uh, the Tinder thing, and then last night. That was it. But that's like, the Tinder thing was blown out of proportion from fucking Reddit. And then last night was just, I was taken advantage of, so it's not fair. Oh, you need to call Coggins. Dude, Cog, what the fuck did I say about Coggins? You said, you said Coggins was so gay. Like, when you met him in person, you 100% confirmed that he's gay. <laughs> oh, no. I mean... Yeah, and it's, I mean, it's true. My gaydar was, I mean, going off a little bit. I'm sorry, Coggins. Oh, yeah. And also, what else was fucked up? You said, you said that he doesn't hate him as well. That I don't, that he doesn't hate him? Yeah. Uh, I mean, like, I mean, he doesn't. Why, I mean, does he want me to say he hates him? Like, wh like what? I mean, that's fucked up, man. Why? Why like, would you, why is it fucked up not to hate them? You know, I saw a clip, I actually did saw a clip that my, some, one of my mods fucking sent me, because it was fucking bad, uh, and I, okay, I felt, that was the one thing that I said that I really was like, wow, why did I say that? I literally said that, um, was, I said shadow people, and then I said, uh, apparently I, I don't even remember this, but apparently I compared them to shit, and asked if they had been flushed. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you were on one last night. Um, <laughs> no, like, I, like I did not mean to say that. Like, I must have meant something else. Like, I would have, I would never say that. Like, I've, like, I would, like, why would I say that? Like, you know what I mean? Like, I must have meant some something else, dude, for sure. Yeah. And I don't yeah. know why you're laughing about that, but. I mean, because you're just real retarded. So retarded last night. I don't know how you were that retarded after eight shots. And then after eight shots, like, I was, my first time ever getting drunk, I was in a lot better mind state. No, me. you were Dude, you were saying some weird shit, too. What do you mean? And I also mixed alcohols. You didn't. So it's different. Like, what do you mean? Yeah, that just made you vomit. Dude, sure. you were, like, making out with Petey and shit. What do you mean? I wasn't making out with Petey. I think I kissed him on the lips, right? No, you made out with him with tongue. No, I didn't. I I definitely didn't do that. All right, well I gotta go. I'll talk to you later. All right then. 
Uh, okay. Um, what was I saying here? SSJI gained a lot of respect for you last night. You were a true lead, and that ice is back. Paul, you are seriously fortunate to have someone who can get 10% happily with only 4.5 inches. So, Sam, would you like getting sucked off by him? <laughs> hey, yo, Harvey, I have to, uh, I have to apologize. Please. How about you and Sam break this sexual tension already? Harvey. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. For everything that I said. I like Hennessy. You have a lot of content that's more than my thing. You have nothing to apologize for about Jesse. You have no idea that Piggy's on top of you. If you watch the video, if you say who's that one that beast, just go in for it. Please ban it from CS. Looks like you finally got that blackout. You always wanted Paul. How was that, bud? Oh yeah, I should call it Blade. I can see why Blade gropes people now. Like it's an like it's easy to grope motherfuckers when you blacked out because you don't even know what what shit is. Yeah, I mean that was that was fine. Um, I, I mean nobody actually got mad by shit. I don't think, but yeah, no, I was uh, dude, it was bad. Like I didn't even know that I was touching her. Like it was bad. All right, let me see what the next clip here is. All right, so the next clip it says not racist. By the way, this does not seem like a good clip for me. Oh yeah, that's the clip. <laughs> I don't even remember that, homie. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I do not remember that, dude. <laughs> Why did I say that for? <laughs> That's so fucked up, bro. Sir, vape man. <laughs> no. No, I don't want to. I don't want that. But you just said that you like Henny. I like Henny, but. I'm, I'm be real with you. I don't like Henny, but. I also don't want to drink today. Yeah, but no, I you you have more content than drinking honey. Yeah, I apologize. Dude, did you not see? He literally magically stole Hannah. Yeah, she might rape me one day, but what? Did you see him hit on Hannah? He literally just did this. You and Hannah just magically sat next to him. I mean, I really thought when I I thought that Hannah blew you last night when I looked at Reddit. That's what I that's what I, I literally thought that because that's what the whole Reddit was saying was that Hannah. Was like coming on to you. Who's Hannah? The blonde hair one. Sam's girlfriend? Oh, the one that has swapped the wig out? Yeah. Oh, I don't say numbers, but. <laughs> well, I mean, that's. I mean, but, Sam, I'm on suicide watch here now. I'm sorry, homie, but. Uh, yeah, I mean. So, check this out, bro. If you really about that Henny life, you really apologize, I feel like the only right thing to do. Is to take a shot with me. I do. You can't like you properly do apologize. Man. Clean him up and pay for him to fuck the hog with Jesse. <laughs> Little pigs. <laughs> that's a good idea. That's funny. No, what the fuck? Um. Call Jesse and confront her for trying to do you. Oh, I will. Um. Sam, what's Jess? Can you text me Jesse's number, dude? Um. Harvey, I can't drink that, bro. Like, I'm, like, right, I have a headache still. Like, I'm not, I'm, I'm like, motherfucking hungover right now. Like, I'm not trying to drink no fucking alcohol on me. And I don't even like Henny. Why do you apologize to people if you don't mean it, man? No, you know, you know, you don't I'm sorry, it. but I don't like Henny, dude. Like, I think you're cool. I'm, you have more content than drinking Henny. I, I apologize. I take that one back. But I don't like, I don't like Henny, though. I like you, but I don't like Henny. I don't think, well, I am... I am Henny. <laughs> but, but do I have to drink you? You say some pretty gay shit. I don't see why. How about this? I'll, I won't i will drink the Henny, but I'll fucking give you a kiss. Alright, here. Kiss me right here. <laughs> Yo, man. I'll do this. Let's get it. There you go. So, you don't have to apologize to people, man, if you don't mean it. It ain't no point. 
just be a dickhead and just accept it. Like, it's cool. Like, no, I do mean it. What are you saying, dude? Yeah, I just look. don't want any more alcohol. No, I'm talking Are you about, trying to peer pressure me I'm in the liquor? About, I'm talking about, Are you trying to get me drunk again? So I can get raped by Jesse? Do you want me to get raped? Who is Jesse? The fucking, the slug. Oh, with the, um... The, sl- the, the one that went on me. The blueberry muffin stomach girl? Uh, I don't know, but she looks like a slug. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, the, the only other girl that wasn't Hannah, dude. With I mean, the detachable head. Yeah, wait, what? The wig. Oh, yeah, potato head. Yeah, that's her. Yeah, 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 okay, cool. I, just, I don't be knowing people by their real name and shit. Well, I mean, yeah, the one that looks like Miss Potato Head. So, she motherfucking ass, you know, what, what were we talking about? Yeah, no, she, stop, bro, I don't, I'm not, apologizing I'm not trying to, ass. dude, you, you don't owe these people shit. You don't owe me shit. You're ice Poseidon. You get paid to exist. We're all just parts of your simulation. I like I like him. I like him. I don't need to apologize. I love you. That's to, no, to nobody. And with that said, anything is possible. Please track to the content DIY one hundred dollars and one. Go to just see what we play. So <laughs> yeah, I said you were an NPC. That's right. Dude, I'm sorry. I mean, listen, Harvey. It was funny though. It was funny though. Wasn't it? Was it funny? Anything. I was, I was. I mean, it was like it's not bad. Like it's a. It's a. It was. That one was good. Um, let me see. Well, shit. Sounds like. Let me see. What is it? Well, shit. Sounds like you had a rough. You had a rough. Lee, 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 Lee. Well, yeah. Thank you for the forty bucks, dude. I had a rough. Uh, it wasn't rough. I didn't have a rough night, but it was fun, dude. It was fun for sure. Let me see. Play scratch for content today. One hundred dollars. Go to CA Lottery. Uh, I don't want to play fucking lottery, dude. Drink a shot, you'll feel a lot better. I don't want to drink any alcohol for a while, dude. I'm sorry. Listen to me, we're waiting for you to make a mistake so they crucify you for it. They're all a bunch of leeches. You think so? You think people are waiting for me to make a mistake to crucify? Who's, who's, no one's crucifying me. Except for, like, Bree. I don't want to drink any Henny, dude. I don't want to drink Henny. I'm fucking, no, I don't feel good right now. I don't want to drink no damn Henny, dude. Why the hell would I get need to be peer pressured into drinking alcohol? I'm not disrespecting him. I just don't feel like drinking alcohol, dude. Let me see. Here's a recap of what you said. All right. Well, we're already going through it, dude. But thank you. All right. I'm sorry to those guys. Fucking, uh, I did not mean to say that they, I'm not even going to, I can't, I cannot call them, dude. I'm not admitting. I'm not admitting that I. Like, I can't tell them that I said that. I, I'm not going to call them and say, tell them I said that. I can't. He's a good EJ, yeah, okay, I saw a post. He said he spent $200. EJ spent $80 since we tied. I was like, if we tie, we split the cost. Do you guys agree? They were like, we're down for it. Um, and then at the end of it, he put 80 down, and I paid for the rest out of the 200 So, Or I think, uh, no, he put 80 down. Tracksuit paid for his, which is like twenty dollars, and I put the rest down. No, I don't want to drink fucking any, dude. Let me see. Hannah says I'm not. Drunk Paul is great. Yo, what the fuck? Yo, Hannah's just talking. Hannah doesn't have a big vagina. I was fucking around. I don't want to drink any damn henny, dude. I don't. I don't want to drink no henny, dude. Someone, dude, I did not say, I, look, I can't believe I said that, the flush down toilet thing. Uh, that's an interesting idea. I mean, we might do something like that, but, you know, only time will tell. Let's see what this is. By the way, did I use the flamethrower when I was drunk and then, like, roast my landlord? Because that is not good. That's because somebody told me I did that, and I was like, yikes, like, oh no. Like, I don't even know where the clip is, but I don't even want to know. Apparently, yeah, I used the flamethrower. Somebody was like, why are you using the flamethrower? Then I started roasting my landlord, so that's not good. Uh, thank you, dude. I appreciate that. I'm not trying to get burnt down. Thank you, Willie. 
Dude, Sam is. Everyone supports him so he can think he's fucking human. I don't think Sam's him. bisexual, but blowjob's a blowjob. To be fucking honest with you, like I'm okay with that. Can you please call Jesse? All right, hold on, dude. Deborah, just let me watch this clip first. You won't talk about it. That time at Joe's Pizza. You won't talk about that time at Joe's Pizza. Wait, Kyle. Kyle, what are you talking about? What time at Joe's Pizza are you talking about? I'm not really sure what you. What do you mean? Uh, you should eat something to sober up. I ate some Chipotle over there. And some fruit. Give them a chance to make money. Yeah, I mean, hey, EJ and Jermaine, I would rather give them the opportunity to make money than some random fucking homeless guy, for sure. Like, they're actually cool ass dudes. And we're definitely gonna, you know, hang out with them again. So, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Like, they, they're cool as fuck, the good sports. Jermaine passed the fuck. Like, he was fucked. He was, like, being dragged to his car, but I lasted longer than he did. I did. I lasted longer than he did before I started throwing up and shit. So I uh, consider myself proud of that, considering I never really drink like that. So, and he says he drinks all the time. Let me see. Were you asked me to have sex with Caroline with you? Yo, Kyle, that was a long time ago. I did not ask you to have... Wait. Oh, yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, I asked Kyle if he could have a threesome with me and Caroline a long time ago. When we were openly dating. Um... <laughs> I don't, that's not like cuck shit. It's just like threesome. Like, I don't know. Um, I mean, I don't know, dude. Kyle's like a good friend of mine. I wouldn't want him to have sex with my current girlfriend, but with Caroline, like, I, I don't know. I just didn't, when we first started dating, it was, I didn't think it was going to be like a long-term thing. So I didn't really care. And I was just like, yo, Kyle, do you want to fucking have sex with her with me? So, uh, Ice, when will you openly admit that you're bisexual? Well, I am not bisexual, nor am I gay. Um, but I'm down. Like, I don't like dicks and shit don't scare me you know what i mean like it doesn't matter like if somebody shows me their dick fuck it and if i touch it fuck it but it's not like i'm not turned on by it you know what i mean but let's see what this is Okay. Did I hear Hennessy? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I was talking about the clip where I apparently said I was gonna put my dick in your mouth. I said during the the ride that you still had feeling for Caroline and you leave her number on stream. Who is Caroline? <laughs> You, you don't want to know, homie. You know, you also said everybody goes. I did not say that, Michael Johnson. You're fucking retarded. Because I would definitely have gotten many texts about that, um, and many clips about that. He didn't say none of this. This is all a figment of y'all imagination. Dude, I do not want to have sex with you. I don't. I'm sorry. Paul, it's okay. where the love of all is stop giving this love attention. Harvey has no content. <laughs> You're right. I have none. <laughs> No, you do have content. Don't worry about what that motherfucker said. Oh, relevant. The Bird of Planet, RB Andy, Mexican Andy, EBZ, SGC, and other in the guest house with no light. No light streamed. Last to survive gets a garage as a permanent space in the I mean, dimension. maybe. I don't know if I want Burger Planet in the fucking garage, even that. Um, I didn't listen. You're an attractive man. I would have a threesome with you if I was single with a random girl. But I do not want to have sex with solely just yourself. I'm sorry. Harvey don't do threesome. <laughs> All right, well then, problem solved. We're good then. Fuck it, dude. I mean, oh, why the hell would you want to have a threesome with me? You're right. When you can have a threesome with two girls, dude, or some, or just no threesome, you can enjoy it so your dick experience doesn't go. Yeah. <clears throat> We're only going up. Yeah, for, I mean, it's, I mean, I'm, that's good shit, homie. No, but that was, uh, why were you just staring at the camera for like two hours last night? And not doing anything. Why were y'all doing what y'all was doing? I it mean, was, it was fun, dude. Yeah. How, I mean, is, was staring at the camera fun? For like two hours? I was looking at y'all. Yeah, well, you, why didn't you contribute to conversation? Y'all had enough. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, dude. Fuck it, dude. I mean, I feel like... Where did the LSD go? I just remembered. I don't know where the LSD went that was on my uh, table. 
Somebody probably stole it, dude. Fucking rip DJ Pans. Yo, fuck DJ Pans. But, uh, all right. I mean, let's go on to the next clip, though. Harvey's the most real. Y'all stop hating. No one's hating, but um, Harvey's fucking good as shit. Harvey, you're fucking awesome, dude. Let me tell you something. You should do more staring straights. No, wait. Yo, if, uh... You should, if, the, if I get a girl over here somehow, would you do a, a stream with her and sleep with her? Harvey is the most real. Y'all stop hating. Honestly, she had to pay me, bro. And I would just sleep with her. I can't be bought. <laughs> what do you mean, dude? <laughs> okay. Um, all right, let's uh, go on to the next one. Bold is sad. Let's see what I said about. I, so I remember, I remember, I said he lived in a... He was gonna live in a box or something. He's gonna live in a shoebox. Yeah. We have literally a, a, a big ass like wooden box in the backyard. We're gonna build it, but Bolt's head is gonna live inside of a wooden box. Um, I like Bolt's head, he's my friend of 10 years, but he doesn't pay rent, so we're gonna make him live inside of like wooden box. Because I mean, if you don't if you don't pay rent, that's what that's what you get. Like that's how it works, dude. So we need to save the rooms for people who actually no, dude. What did I say? What did I say, dude? To, to, to the content, dude. So we're gonna make all this head live inside of a box, inside of a wooden <laughs> shoe box. Like not a shoe box, but like a wooden fucking like a, like a car box in the backyard. Like we're literally gonna build like a box of two by fours, and that's where all this head will, will live with all his amiibos. <laughs> oh no, dude. Please get charged to the slap five dollars for a big goodness. No, dude. CX, I'm not gonna slap tracks in, but you do. Um, I said that you need therapy. I do not need therapy. But, I'm telling you how she really is, but thank you very much. I mean, I might need therapy, dude. Oh, jeez. Let me, uh, let me go grab Voldasad so I can ap apologize for him. Or just see what he thinks about that one. Did you see the clip where I said you should live in a box? I saw that. Um, what do you think about that? You know, I don't expect anything. I don't even expect, like, a room. So the fact that you'd even make a box for me and let me stay on the premise is good enough. You don't need to apologize for shit. I think it'd be kind of cool to be a box streamer. You're just saying that, though. You don't really mean it. No, I mean, as long as there's room for my amiibos, <laughs> that's all I care about in life. Sandy, Dude, no, I mean, I, this guy in the chat, this, that's, that's a funny name. He's saying, uh, uh, Voldasad Planet. You know, like Burger Planet? Oh, I call him Pizza Time still. So. Oh, uh, Voldas, I mean, Voldasad Time. Okay. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding, but, <laughs> no, I'm just joking, but, uh, uh, you're not living in a box, dude. Oh, okay. Like, yeah, I, I, I don't expect anything. From it, so the fact that you'd even bring me on board, even on a box, is a okay with me. No, you're not living. Like, I've already told you I'll take the smallest room, but if the smallest room or the closet or the office isn't available, I'll go to the box. That's fine, dude. You don't need to live in a don't worry, I got you. Okay, you don't gotta live in no damn box okay. because yeah, it's gonna be cold, it's not gonna be no toilet. Like, what? Like, I don't understand. All right, like, I can't, like, that. I was just, well, I must have been trolling, dude. Hey, Paul, like, I must have been hey, joking dude. at the time. I thought it was. Great streaming recently. Myself and the dark web love it. Oh, Andy. Fuck one Mary and one kill one. Ooh. Mexican Andy. Burger Planet. Harvey. <laughs> kill all three. <laughs> anyway, what were you saying? Uh, I don't even know. Anyway, I thought it was funny as fuck. Like, it, it, it's, it's a ramble. It, it's goofy. Anyone who got offended should is a pussy and needs to grow up. So exactly. I, thought it, I thought it was very funny. It was good content. Everything on that list was great. <laughs> why, is, why are people saying Voldasad wagon? Oh, that's he called me Voldas wagon last night. Volkswagen. Volkswagen. <laughs> it was funny as hell. Oh, okay. Let me see it. Vold. K. Kill yourself and you two ice. Thank you, dude. I will happily do that. Well worth uh, five dollars. I will. Do, I will happily do that when the time is right. Thank you so much, dude. I appreciate it. Um, this guy says great streams recently, and then yeah, cool. Um, 
I hate to chime in here, Paul. Do you remember the time Geisha was drunk and she wanted to suck both of us off while we were smoking hookah? Wait, Andy Milanakis, what are you talking about? Geisha? No, you're lying. That's not. That's probably not Andy. That's not. What the fuck are you saying? Geisha was never drunk and wanted to suck both of us off. What are you at a hookah lounge? I mean, I don't remember that at least if it's true. Did you ever lost the puke out of your hair from sticking your head in your bar foot? No, I didn't. It's all crusty still. No. Oh, actually, I took a shower today. It should be clean. But the puke bucket is still in the backyard with all the puke in it. She has your attention. Also, please play scratchers for content. And let me call her. I mean, I, she's probably not going to answer, but I'll, I'll, uh, actually, I'll, uh, fuck it, I'll call her, dude. <laughs> Whatever, I'll just text her and say sorry. Sorry about the anal thing. LOL. Alrighty. Yeah, there you go. She never answers my calls anymore, dude. So, uh, all right. Let's see what we got here. Percentages. Oh, no. We are not fucking lit, dude. What is this? Percentages. Okay, me and this goes to jobs. This goes to jobs and Jacob for being the percentage. We have the most equity in the company, though. I can't do that. I'm not going to fly out his ex-girlfriend. What the hell are you talking about, dude? I mean, it doesn't really matter if I say it, but it's just like, none of, it's just nobody's fucking business, you know? Bone Clinks also said on CX News that he doesn't think Jacob should get any sort of equity in the company. I disagree with that. Jacob's worked his ass off, and he 100% deserves equity in the company. Bone Clinks, you were wrong about that one, homie. Before the end of the month, because today, the assistant of the investors gave us the dealio of uh, the bank account that has all the money. They put a lot of money in the account today. Half a mil. And we're... Out of two mil. Because they're they're paying us in quarter. Like, they're, they're paying us quarterly, if right. that makes if that makes sense. Use all 300k of half a mil for the house. And then the rest is for an RV. So we can travel the country with the money. I shouldn't say that. It's true. All right. Uh, I mean, that's about right. I mean, uh, I mean, I don't really. There's, I mean, that's about that's that's about right. Um, it's nobody's business, but fuck it, dude. Let me see. Somebody invested money in us. Let's see. Somebody invested money in us. You can't get offended by somebody who's got a bucket on their head, though. But yes, I do remember calling Harvey an NPC. I mean, how is he not an NPC? Like, come on. He's like a Grand Theft, Grand Theft Auto 4 character, dude. No, I mean, not even. I think, bro, Harvey, I really hope you don't get offended by this. But you're, you're literally, you're like a Grand Theft Auto Vice City character. Because you only have like three phrases. In GTA 5, they, they have like 20 phrases. You want to know what none of my phrases are? What? I'm sorry. Fuck apologizing to these people. I just... <laughs> Why do you say that? You don't... If you're going if you gonna to be on fuckery, you got to be on fuckery all the way. You don't just blow the entire world up and then like apologize for it. You just blow the world up. No, that makes you Hitler. Makes you a bad person. You have to yeah, apologize. But, but guess what? Hit, an apologizing Hitler is a bitch. You don't want to be a bitch. I... A non-apologizing apologizing Hitler is a sociopath who kills people. But I guess you're already a sociopath that kills people anyways. So what's apologizing going to do? Right. Just be yourself. 
That's what it's about. People but I don't think that, I mean I didn't kill nobody though. But I mean I can, you, sorry is a good phrase. It's a good thing to say. It's nothing wrong with anal. It's nothing wrong with getting a half a million dollars to drive around in an RV. It's nothing wrong with slugs, as long as you keep salt for them motherfuckers. And last but not least, it's nothing wrong with NPC characters. Every game needs them. <laughs> so what are you apologizing for? You're right. Fuck it. Why would what the fuck? Why would I apologize? I mean, when you put it like that, I just thought I was being a dick. But you're right. I mean, everything you just said, the world fucking needs. Um, or like, it doesn't matter. So, I mean, you're right. Like, why? Like, fuck it, dude. I mean, I'll still apologize, though. Or not really apologize. I'll just call people, though, and see what the fuck they have to say. But, yeah, fuck, fuck apologizing. You're right about that shit! You can't be Batman, Bane, and the Joker in the same movie, bro. You gotta, you know? Yeah, you gotta only be Bane. You don't wanna be Batman. Of course. Fuck Batman. Batman's gay. Um, I mean, it's true. Like, why would somebody not invest money into that? The potential for greater contents in the horizon, my friends. Um, let me see. Some, let me see. ISO is 60%. We already saw that one. SSJ. Let's see. I'm going to show him. Yo, Brent! Brent! C come here! Wait, come here, dude! Harvey looks like he's having an existential crisis right now. Harvey running for your life home. So you ask me I'm just gonna say this and then I'm leaving. Because, like, the eye contact between Sam and Evan was so intense that night. Wait, I didn't see Evan blink. Like, it was like, with a dick. Like, well, of course. You know what of I mean? Course. Like, I mean, that's it's a dick. You wouldn't be a good no, dick sucker if you were like not looking at trendy eyes solid of the person, eye right? Eye contact, solid eye contact. But what do you think about this? Did you see this clip? No, what is this? Are you sure you didn't see it? No, I actually. Didn't. Oh God! Alrighty. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show him like, yo, you need to get the fuck out of my house. To me? I don't know who I said that to. Don't insult my house. Wait, hold on. It's apparently, <laughs> apparently, it's not done yet. Oh. But I don't see it. He, he, does, he sees. I mean, he bought the website and all that shit. Yeah. That's great. Where the fuck's the house? Motherfucker, my landlord hates me. And she's ready to throw the fuck out because we use Lego shit. And I'm like, motherfucker, I don't want to get kicked out. Uh, Alright, well, that's it. That's what I'm saying. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, listen, I don't, listen, 
there was some truth to that, but I not really. I asked for the furniture in my house because I wanted more furniture, and uh, I mean, I know when the streamer house is coming, so it's. I, I don't know why I said that. I was just trolling and fucking around, I guess. Wait, is this an apology stream where you're supposed to apologize to people? No, Harvey told me a fucking apology. I'm just telling you. Oh, okay. I'm just telling you, like, what I what was going so through my head. Happened? Uh, what did you What did you think about I, that? I have seen that clip. What did you think about it? I didn't care. <laughs> I was like, I don't know, whatever. Okay, good. I mean, I'm I, homeless, and you let me stay here for free. Like, uh, also, when so. you just wanted to suck you off, you were saying something you should have known you wanted to do something for me. Sorry, Paul, but you deserve that. What? Well, Gage just said you're gonna suck your eyes. No, I didn't. Andy, I don't want to fucking have sex with you, dog. What are you saying? <laughs> Why would I want to have sex with Ant? Like Andy, I don't want to. What the fuck? Um, all right, thank you, dude. That was good. Uh, let me see. All right, Harvey J. What do we say about Harvey here? Why did I say that about her? When did I say that? When the hell did I say that? What? What the fuck, dude? Alright, I don't know. No. I don't know why I said fuck Harvey J. It's just Coke. No, it's not. It's real Hennessy. I don't no, know. I was just trolling, but I don't know why I said fuck. Take a shot, bro. I, dude, I cannot, homie. It's Coca-Cola, man. I cannot. You afraid of Coca-Cola now? No, I'm just, I don't, it's, it proves it's real Hennessy. I don't want it, dude. But I, I don't, I'm sorry. I'm, I fucking put an apology. I don't know why I said fuck Harvey J. I must have been joking. I don't hate you. I don't know why. If I hated you, I wouldn't have invited you here. I don't know why I said that. I just have a real theory about what happened yesterday. Who was that? Who was that? Yeah. yeah. Surprise. <coughs> What's up, Trey? Wait, who are you? I'm Ronnie. You Where, can call me Trey. Where'd yeah. you Where'd you come from? Uh, outside the Netherlands. What are you like a Harvey J. Disciple or something? What do you mean? Yeah, me and all that. No, I, I fucking I came from SF, <laughs> running miles. Who are you here with? Myself. I didn't even come Fuck in. it, dude. You're just chilling. Check. Fuck it, dude. You want a Medela? <laughs> We're running a trap house here. You want a Medela? A what? A Medela. No, no. I don't want to drink anything right now, dude. I just have a real theory about what happened last night. What happened last night? You were extremely drunk, said something that was true. And covered up, you started just going off on everybody else so no one could figure out what the one truthful thing that you said was. I mean, what if everything was just true? I mean, honestly, everything so far is about true. Um, so, I mean, it's... I didn't want to say, like, half of those things, but fuck it. Um, all right, so let's see. Isis X. That was the same clip. Aria, Aria, Aria Nina sucked Isis dick after the Chatterbait stream. That is true. When did we talk about this? He just came in here and offered us some more. Nina was here, and she was like, Hey, Brent, you know I give the best blowjob ever. I want to give Ice the best blowjob in the world. I would not even be jealous I did. I'm so happy you get a good friend. Bro, like, she's Nate so Nate Brees, good. Hit back on Twitter, Nate Brees, hit back on Twitter, Nate Brees, hit back on Twitter. Nina gives good blowjobs. She sucked my dick during the Chatterbait stream. And she Equity over Ince's boy. Equity over Ince's boy. That's it. What a hell did I say that? streamers that have left the CX network been able to get a streamer house before you. That's embarrassing. SSJ is incompetent. Uh, because they have money and we don't at the moment? Or, I mean, we didn't at, before. We do now, but, uh, all right, let me see. Uh, Sam Pepper. All right, so let me see. Ari Nina, we got Sam. Wait, did I talk about Destiny? What? 
Yo, Sam Pepper is some other shit. Listen, I like Sam. I really do like Sam. But this motherfucker thinks he knows what's up. He's, he thinks he knows everything. But you know what? Sam's like God. He thinks he knows everything, Drunk but he... Drunk are sober man's thoughts. Now that you're truthful, just tell me. Don't you want to get laid tonight? No, I have a girlfriend. I was born to the Did he leave his fucking TTS in here, dude? Fucking left his TTS in here, dude. While, while I'm streaming, dog. I love my girlfriend, dude. I would never want to cheat on her. Um, but hey, I, what, hey, at least I said I would I, never want to cheat my girlfriend, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And like, at least I was being, you know, at least I wasn't saying some dumb shit. Happening with your YouTube channel and your editing situation. Sam Hepper thinks he knows who he's talking about half the time, but he doesn't. Yo, but Harvey, I still love him. I Let me see, we live right on TX right Network again. How did this SG do? You have a I mean, me oh. I've seen you at Patchwalk. I can be forward you did. Okay, well, Harvey's not here, but thank you. I don't even know what that means, but thank you, dude. Yeah, no, I mean, listen, Sam does think he knows it all, but I still like him. That is definitely true. He's he's definitely a know it all, though for sure. Um, let me see. Keenan and I is getting blowjob from Katie. Oh, no. I'll strike with you, Darrell. Keenan wants to fuck Bree and Katie. That's not good. But Bree and Katie's ugly. I fucked Katie. No, I fucking I had Katie suck my <laughs> dick. <laughs> no. Katie suck my dick, but her ass is on her period. So I oh no, dude. Oh no, dude! The fucker, but her she was the worst blowjobber I've ever had in my life. She didn't know how to get blowjobs for shit. Katie sucked dick for like she sucked so bad at blowjobs, dude. I literally didn't even come, dude. I was like, just stop. I just told her, I'm like, just stop. Like you're clearly not into it. You're horrible. I mean, Bree, she's a little, she's another story, dude. She probably fucks Evan for clout because she's a little. She's something else, dog. Yo, you little bitch, thanks for the bean bags. Me and the bitches are loving them. Anything is possible. Yo, where the fuck is Harvey, dude? I'm gonna ask him. Where, where's Harvey? Rumble right is there. Dead. Where's Harvey? I, he hasn't He's come out. Discover. Why was I gonna ha call her a bitch? I don't even know what I was saying, dude. Damn. Damn. I said. <laughs> Oh no, dude! Yeah, I'm, no, I'm away. I haven't seen I'm away. no, I even said the whole period shebang. Oh, jeez. Okay. 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 <laughs> fuck. Fuck it, dude. <laughs> fuck it. I mean, it's fucked up of me, but fuck it, dude. Sorry, Katie. I'm sorry. That was fucked up. I should not have said that. That was. Just, oh. I mean, you say fucking apology, but that was fucked up. Come on. He's still apologizing. Well, what do you think I should say to that? Nothing. Just move on? Yeah, he's, he's done. Over with. Yeah, but, you know, if you apologize, you look like less of a shitty person. Be a fuck shitty it. person. Fuck it, dude. Fuck it. I don't fuck it, dude. Sorry, Katie. I'll never number or nothing, so fuck it. Grimoire's not a trash, it's a good girl. I'm not gonna tell you what the company name is because we did trademark it, but it's I love the Taurus best that is and fastest. Yo, fuck Latoris, dude. I hate that motherfucker. He leeches off my shit. I hate his ass. <laughs> I'm not gonna I typically wouldn't say that, but he leeches off my shit. He literally does. He is a better editor than my fucking shitty ass editor. Keon's a little bitch, but I fucking hate he, I fucking hate Keon. He's a little bitch, you know that? But Latoris is also a little fucking bitch as well. I need to get Chad's editor. He's a little... He, he's nice. He's... Oh, no, dude! Nice. <laughs> oh, no! I've not tested him, but he's nice. Keon's a bitch, but Latoris is also a bitch. Oh! <laughs> Alright, so you're really tapping into your manhood here. This is true <laughs> testosterone at its finest. Yeah, but that's not something that should be said in, on a live stream, you know? That's not something I, that I should say on stream. That's fucked. That's fucked, dude. No. We need to call so the Milker sisters now and apologize. On speaker. We want to hear the side of both of them. They are watching. You need to walk in and apologize on speaker. We hear both sides. Well, I don't even know their numbers, dude. So I can't really do that. But... Alright, if they're watching, 
All right, listen. I'm just going to send a DM because I don't know their numbers. And I'm just going to say, my bad on the on the whole period leak because that's fucked up. This might as well be church. It's not even Sunday. Actually, fuck it, dude. Fuck it. I'm sorry. Fuck it, dude. I'll just, uh, they can just get over it, dude. Um, let me see. Latar is talking about percentages. All right, we already went through that. Talking about Destiny. I mean, a TCD fan in 2019. That motherfucker doesn't even stream, bro. He can't even. He literally sharpies. Call Destiny if he wants to help you appeal your band. He literally sharpies shit out of Carver content. And Destiny, Destiny literally, like, he's a good guy, but he doesn't know what he's talking about half the time. All I met that on is your name's Homie. What are we doing to What are we? Yo, Destiny doesn't know what he's talking about. About half the time, he really doesn't. I mean, it I is true. He does. And Destiny talks out of his ass because because he, he's too confident in what's going on. So let me guess, you're gonna apologize to the fucking marker you used? No, I'm not gonna apologize to anyone. But uh, I mean, that's true. Destiny doesn't know what he's talking about half the time. He's kind of like Sam. Like Destiny and Sam are pretty much like hand in hand in what they like. <laughs> I would say Destiny is a more. Oh, how do I say this though? Uh, fuck it, dude. Sam won't get offended by this because it's it's just kind of like... I mean, I like Sam. Destiny is kind of like a more uh, likable Sam in terms of like... I don't know. I, like, they're both a little pretentious, but Destiny is... You know, thinks out what he says a little bit more, I feel. Um, but I mean, I'm not... I mean, he's not a... I love Sam, dude. Like, I'm not fucking talking shit or nothing it's just you know thoughts like i don't know like my uh like i'm i'm fucking like fucking dude saying because they whatever about me like i would never get offended by it so <laughs> let me see um evan sucks sam's dick for rent i know i'm a very evan evan that. literally sucked sam's dick for rent he did i didn't want to say it. it was a secret but sam literally asked evan to suck his dick and evan sucked his fucking dick what? Evan sucked Sam's <laughs> dick for rent. I'm serious. Evan's fucking Why gay. Why is this happening on stream if that's actually... <laughs> Evan's true. fucking gay, dude. He literally... He asked Sam, can I suck your dick for rent? And Sam was like, fuck it. And then Hannah thought it was hot and she watched it. And Evan sucked Sam's dick. I really hope all of this is made up. Um, that's true. Also... It is definitely true. Where um, do you find this information? Like, where do you find these people? What do you mean? I witnessed it. You find all these people, like, on Hollywood Boulevard? Where did you even find these people? Who? Evan? The people involved. Uh, well, Evan stream sniped me about a year ago, uh, and he gave me cologne, and then brought over some girl from Tinder, and then it's for, like, content or something. And then uh, Evan, that's how he started. And uh, he came back another day. And then we were just like, oh, let's fucking hang out. And I don't even remember, dude, but something You're like that. You're an asshole. After I bend over backwards for you, I talk to higher ups at Twitch and you say this about me. Not a real friend. Lawsuit. Dan Coming. Defamation from a goblin? I think not. Dest. That's not really destiny because that's not defamation. It's literally the truth. Um, so you basically enable and. You push people to stalk you, and you, huh? put, you push them further. Like, people stream snipe you, and you give them a career? Yes. Is that wrong? So you, you perpetuate people following you around and stalking Mexican you. Andy slapped someone on stream. Hold on, I'll check that in a second. Um, yeah, if you stream snipe me, and I think you're interesting, I will give you a streaming career. I mean, why is attention, that? Like, attention. tracksuit Andy, you like Paul, him, right? you're not fooling anybody. That's Only time I ever saw this type action was when someone got a contact to hire from a chemical. Have you been around chemicals? And don't apologize to no one. Uh, no, I was just drunk. Do you like tracksuit Andy? He's cool. Well, he's, he was also a stream sniper. Everyone around me was a stream sniper, dude, originally. So after they stream snipe, what's the next level for them? I mean, we either become friends or... 
you know, I convinced him to start streaming. One of the two options. Max and Andy, everybody. Like, literally everybody. I wasn't a stream sniper. You weren't, no. But I'm saying a lot of others were. Um, and it's not, it's not a bad thing. You know, I don't think, like, it, it doesn't, like, I don't want to be stalked by people. But if it happens, fuck it. Like, I don't know. Like, if I get stalked, fuck it, dude. Like, that's not bad half the time. Because sometimes I meet some interesting people. Dude, this one guy was stalking me. Give me four hundred dollars. Then he said he's gonna jump off a cliff and like kill me by looking at me with like a heart attack or something. But he gave me four hundred dollars, so fuck it. What'd you spend it on? Um, I don't know. I don't remember. Just like I put it in my bank account. That was it. So yeah. it was fun. All right, here we have. Uh, 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 let me see. Brandon. TDD Ben Swat. I fucking hate, dude. Here's the thing. TDD Brandon is on a whole nother level of retardedness. I like. Brandon, he's a charismatic guy, but he is so fucking ridiculous. He's he literally backstabs everybody, and I don't like that. Paul, apologize if you feel like it. Don't let others pressure you into not you guys doing don't so. Don't really understand how much shit he talks about you guys. I mean, fuck it. He has a good point though. Why shouldn't? Like off camera and stuff. I had to pee. Uh, just just let it go, man. This is uh. I mean, that's true though. Like that's one hundred percent true. Like, <laughs> like that's not. Me talking shit. It's just a fact. Um, no apology. Oh no, I would. I wouldn't apologize to that. Let me see. Cassandra Anal. I see Miss Cassandra. Why did he stop me from saying all this shit? Why am I saying everything except Steve Jobs? You think she's more content than half the network? I gave Cassandra Anal. What? No, I didn't. No, that's a lie. Wait. I was just trolling. When she was really, really, really down in her times. You had sex with Cassandra. Yes. Wow. <laughs> when she was down on her times, that sounds so bad. That's literally some Weinstein shit, homie. What the fuck? What? I did. Don't Roll feel bad, Pa. We You're just late. airing CX's Dirty Laundry. 2019 Baby Clean Slate. Oh, of course, dude. Fuck it, dude. When she slipped over my house that one night. Wow. Hey, Harvey, can I come sit so next to you and drink some house. more Henny? I, I just found out my boyfriend got a sucked for his frown. Yikes, dude. I did not give her anal. We never even had sex. Like, I wanted to, but she wasn't down for it. Like, what the fuck? Um, hey, Harvey, could I come sit next to you and drink some Henny? I just found out my boyfriend got his dick sucked for rent. Who is that? I don't know. Some donator. Your dick XP points are decreasing rapidly, my friend. <laughs> fuck it, dude. Um, fuck it. Tell, donate again. Tell me about more about your dick XP skills. That'd be nice. Um, let me see. Coggins doesn't hate them. Plus, he's gay. Ice, what do you think about Coggins? Does he really hate them? Actually, Coggins doesn't hate him. He's a he's memeing because I met him in person. He's a faggot. But I met him in person. He's, he's not a faggot, but he's, he's cool. Not a faggot. He, cool. He's cool, but he like he pretends he's not a faggot, but he's gay. He's like, like he's actually gay. Is he? Like I met him. He's actually fucking gay. <laughs> he pretends not to be, but he is. Like I love Coggins, but he like he's definitely gay. I mean, to be fair, Coggins is definitely gay. Um, like he is. Like if you don't, uh, if it's like a Discord thing. If you're on Discord, you'll know who Coggins is probably. He's gay. For, like he didn't tell me he was gay but I can just tell he's fucking gay like I, I can just fucking tell you know what I mean he's got the whole like you know kind of like attitude going on like I don't know I don't like I'm sorry Coggins I don't know if that offends you but fuck it dude like it's true um Sam wants a foursome with ice yeah Sam and Hannah have been wanting to have a foursome for a while I said yes Kimberly was not sure about it but I, I'm trying to convince her because Hannah and Sam, dude, I would love to have a foursome with them. That'd be so fun. <sighs> Take it back. Do not want a foursome with anybody. But, uh, I mean, it could be fun, but, you know, I don't really want it, though. Let me recap. Sam um, has a small dick. Sam's I've seen it. And Hannah has a big fucking clip. I've seen it all. I probably meant to, like, twist that around, but maybe not. I've seen it. We live. I've never head. seen Hannah's vagina. I was just trolling. I've seen it. But I have seen Sam's right, dick. Man, like and I was accurate about that one. I saw all this. Go do some funny shit, homie. 
And can you do the thing with your arm? Yeah, but I haven't seen this. I haven't seen this myself, though, and I'm fucking hungover, so I don't really feel like doing much, to be honest. In Evan's mouth. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I'm just recapping what happened. Stop laughing. Okay, um. What's the hey, neighbors? That's all you gotta do. Watch the lit horse video lol. Alright, let me see. Let me watch. Is a good dude, please don't put your coculus down his throat. Let me see what else we got. Let me go to the juicy stuff. Listen, Bree and, and Evan, you guys don't know what you're doing. And the only content you have is fucking each other and having sex with Sam. I'm sorry to say, it's true. Oh, man. Alright, um... Flame. Oh, okay, this is. Wait. Oh no, dude, what is this? Yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, there's no propane left, so it doesn't matter. The propane is so low in the, in the flamethrower, it doesn't matter. Fuck up! Ah, I don't need your bitch ass, Here, motherfucking get... disgusting Steve Jobs, I'll burn your ass. Okay. What did you say? I'll burn you. What do you mean? I'm part Jewish. No. I, I, I would just catch him right on fire. I'm just kidding, dude. I'm just talking about you. Did you block your landlord on YouTube? Yeah. Yeah, I blocked my landlord on everything. You should. Oh, on Twitter, on Instagram, everything, dude. I don't want my landlord looking at my shit. But no, there's no there's no propane left in this anyway. Yikes. I love this is the propane. Can we get a new propane tank? Yeah. Dude, what the hell? Why was I gonna burn people? What the hell's wrong with me? Oh man, okay. Um, ice calls tracksuit a bitch. You're probably gonna vomit for sure, because you had eight shots. No, eight shots is shit. Remember when I had four shots in Scam Palmer's and, uh... Well, you're a bitch. <laughs> I mean, well, that was for a reason, though. You only had four shots. All right. Everybody's saying call Coggins on Discord. Uh, let's go. Wait, I want to say thank you. Let me what is this? Gonna, what what, what gonna, the fuck are we listening to? It's an old ass video. Thank you, dude. Call Slug. Okay, hold on. I'll call the fuck. I'll call fucking Jesse. Give me a sec. Um, yo, Coggins. What the fuck, Coggins? What the fuck was that, dude? Can you not? Yo, can you not do that? Well, see, that's like, why would I want to call Coggins? I mean, like, like, why would I want to call Coggins when it's like, that's like, what the fuck was that? Like, bro, you're my moderator, dude. Why the fuck would you do that? Fucking dumbass. This is why you're gay, homie. Um, more like a fake text that Sam really wants that force. I need a bucket. I texted you and she said, it's okay for you to watch Sam and Hannah have sex. You're lying. Let me see. I oh, okay. I throw up. I want to see how much I actually threw up. Let's see. Because I still have this shit. And it, apparently it was a lot. Oh my god. He got a text message from an editor. So I'm guessing that's Kian. Oh my god. Yeah, you vomited. That's so thick. Replay media with video. It will prove to Harvey oh, the value of this good, company good, and you reputation as CEO. No, no. I'm Replay Kelsey don't know. Okay, hold on. Bucket, you fucking scumbag. Bucket. Get a haircut. Get you water. Bucket. Keep it kind of long, Bucket. otherwise you look like an escaped Bucket. mental patient. Sorry, I love you, Carl. Bucket. 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 I should get a haircut, you're right, dude. Uh, replay video with media. All right, let me see. What is this? With media, huh? That's when we first met Elixir. He made four hundred twenty dollars by stalking me. How old were you then? Uh, 
This was two years ago. You look Mexican. Yeah, I had no hair, dude. I had fucking short ass hair, homie, so. That's, that's enough, okay? You can go be Jewish somewhere else. Bye. Jewish Take somewhere care. else. Thank you. Goodbye. You. This was at VidCon two years ago, homie, so. That was good. Oh, what's up, EBZ? What up, what up? Chilling, and we got ice throws, throws up. That's that's key key on. More throwing up, huh? It's cold. You have the kick? No, he's not a. They are black and look like shit. <laughs> oh. That was a lot. I'm so proud of you, TSA. For I still sleep straight. Guys, that was all scripted. That was fake. Oh, man. <clears throat> it smells so strong. Dirty How do you feel about me throwing up while listening to Gator Skin? Fucking awesome. <laughs> Fucking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> One thing for sure. Once again, I said, Mexican Andy slapped someone on stream. Like a what? You're probably the only person that I know that can turn throw up into shampoo. Oh, hey, 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 get your hey, hands off of him. Hey, hey, oh, hey, there you go. Hey, hey, yeah, hey, yeah, get him off. Get your there hands you off of him. That's what you get. Oh, That's why. Don't pussy. Hey, hey you you not go. use that language. Jonathan, come here. No, I'm going to slap you again. I'm going to slap you again. Hey, hey, hey. get away. Hey. Hey, but who the fuck is he slapping? Why is he? Get away! Is he in? Indi oh, he's in Indiana right now. Yeah, he was with jo Jonathan Hill. Get away! Ah, I'm fucking, oh. get, 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 get away from me! Huh? Get away from me! Get away! Throw that chair at me! Throw it! Go ahead! Throw that chair! He's throw that chair with me! Throw it! Away. Yeah, throw that chair away! Max and Andy really right growing up in the world, isn't he? Is it true? Is it, are they like seriously fighting? Oh, I think so. Look, I thought you. No, they're definitely joking. This is a game. It is a game right now. Yeah, yeah. This is a game. Ain't no yeah. fucking game, man. Come on, man. Hey, hey calm down. Oh, shit, I'm gonna throw the hammer down. Right now. Hey, hey, I'm throwing it right now. Down. Hey, calm, calm down. I'm gonna throw it away. Buddha, Buddha, Buddha. Send this. Yeah, no, dude, dude, if you're actually mad, you're not like holding a mic up to your face. If you're mad, you just like throw it down. Yeah, it's Mexican Andy. Huh? It's Mexican Andy. So he's only as mad as the stream seems. I mean, maybe. I feel like if you're actually mad, you would just throw it down, though. I'm uh, saying he's not that mad. He's only as mad as the stream can see. So he's got to keep the mic. Back in a week. Not even I'm not even worried. Then talk, trust in a week. Oh my god, you got fucking throw up on your head. Oh my god. Oh, oh. oh dude, it was actually dripping. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh, oh, ice. Ice, that was insane. Dude, I've been slaying in this all day. Oh. Ice, that was not super clean. Yeah, I love this song. I cleaned it a bit, but not that much. Oh my gosh, okay. Uh, and then of course this fucking bullshit, this bullshit ass clip that I never want to see again. No. Ice, you're making a mistake. Let's just pass on this situation. Come on, I. Oh no. What? That's Jesse, right? Dude, what a thought, dude. Why did she do that? Why didn't she just... Why did she... Why did she just go... Why did, why did she not tell me, like, no? Honey, you didn't even wash your hands after that shit, did you? Keep it 100. Wash my hands? You didn't even wash your hands. Dude, I was so blacked out. I didn't even know that I was grabbing Jesse. I thought she was a bucket. I mean... <laughs> I thought she was a bucket. <laughs> I literally thought oh, she was a bucket, you. dude. Plus, man, this lug from CX and tell EBZ. Yo, Scott, you're not a leech, dude. Don't worry. You're just hustling out here. Hey, see, Paul, what's 9 plus 10 plus ban the slug from CX? And EBZ said, hi, he's a cool dude. He is a cool dude. EBZ, you must be getting close to me. What? See, what? Uh -huh. Really acting like a roach by What I don't understand is, why didn't she... Why, why, didn't, why didn't she just be like, yo, stop. Like, she went there with the purpose of, like, trying to be a homewrecker for sure. For sure, dude. She was like... Nah, homie, I don't like that. See, that... that so she took advantage of the situation. Yeah, like, that annoys me, dude. That fucking pisses me off, dude, honestly. Well, maybe fortunately... Kimberly Although I did I did grab Sam and everybody else, too, but still, it's like... She, they don't have the intention of, like, trying to fuck shit up like she does. You should have just called your robot to keep her company. What is this? I'm going to catch a... Wait, she removed her wig? Obviously. Okay, should I really whip off my wig on straight? Jesse, can you give me some tips on how to make money for not leaving somebody's house when they're drunk with their head in the trash can? Okay, Thanks, babe. Oh, it's it's clean. This is like super clean, so like, wait. That's not her fucking hair? 
till she came. She ruined the drunk stream. She talked bad about Hannah. Kick her, please leave. Go home, fake Shut the fuck up. How about that? Hey, John. Yeah, I don't even have her number. Oh, yeah. Sam texted me her number. Let me see. Let me call her real quick. Dude. Oh, jeez. Thank you, Brandy. Appreciate the member. Thank you very much. I'm sorry. The person you were trying to reach has a voicemail box that has not been set up yet. All right. It's, her phone's turned off. Thank the fuck, actually, I guess. What are you guys talking about? And then that's pretty much all the, all the relevant clips here, it looks like. Let's be real. Harvey? Are you actually trying to get with Hannah? Did anyone else notice that was the first time we saw SSG in the video? Worst manager ever. Check. Knows 50 billionaires. Check. Sleeps in his car. Check. <coughs> Travels around WTH 500k in furniture. Check. Oh yeah, Brandy's a chick who's on my name 10,000 times. Hey, hope your stream went well. How you doing? CX in the chat. Okay. Um, she looks better without the wig. I... No comment about any of that. So, um, okay. Were you actually trying to get with Hannah? Who is Hannah? You know, the blonde one. Picture. I'm just going to call Hannah. I'm just going to call her. And then you guys can re rebuttal. Jesse already said she plans on breaking you and Kim up. But yet you still allow her to be around you. So is the idiot. Not anymore. Not Why don't you FaceTime her so I can see her? Hey. Fix your fucking hood, the string, please. Hi. Hey. Hannah, do you remember this guy? <laughs> yes. What what the fuck <laughs> what happened between so, you and him? I was gonna drink his Hennessy, but it smelled bad. And then what? You just stopped drinking fucking Hennessy? You just... Like, cause, I don't know. They, Reddit says that y'all were, like, doing a thing. I decided! What? You you can't keep listening to Reddit. I like him. Yeah, but I woke up, and that's what I saw, so I, I don't know if it was, like, it, what the fuck happened with you guys. You know what I saw? What? That you said I have a big clit. Yeah, I mean, does that? Why Is does that offend? True? Why does that offend you, though? Because I have a small one. But why does it matter if you have a big or small one? It's all the same thing. Do you? Is it like an offensive thing? Uh, it's fine. Like I have a fucking small penis sometimes. Like I don't know. Like my don't. What do you want, mean sometimes? You know when I'm flaccid. Like what the fuck? Like it's the same shit. Hey, so this is Hannah, right? Yeah. You're a winner. You're a winner. What does that mean? You're a winner. I maybe one day I'll drink Hennessy with you. I just can't stand the smell. Oh, that's not Hannah. Mm. What? What the fuck are you saying? Anything is possible. We live. <laughs> Yo, I would be very afraid of our Sam take, right now. I'd be very, very shot. scared at the moment. I love Sam. We take him. We take a shot. But it seems like you're willing to give Harvey J a try. No, 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 no. I only like Sam. <laughs> I drink Hennessy with him, but I wouldn't do anything. Yeah, but what if you drink enough Hennessy? That's when shit gets, you know, anything's possible, right? <laughs> no, 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 no. All right, Hannah. Well, uh, I just wanted to see what the fuck was going on with uh, you and him, because it seemed like. I don't know if I believe fully what you just said, but, you know, I'll just pretend. <laughs> I'll just pretend okay. I believe you. Yo, why? Just pretend we never talked. Okay, bye. Love you. Why is Sam blowing you up? Where is Sam? Oh, Sam is somewhere else. She just said love you. She did. Hey, John Gill, why don't you leave? Hey, I told Hannah I was trolling with the whole clit thing, but uh, <laughs> she's not offended by it. It's fine. Um, yo, why did she said love you? That's weird. Okay, um, fuck it. I stop trying to snitch on I don't know why she said that. No, what else? see, that looks weird now because people are gonna come up with tinfoil hat shit. What? Yeah, go for it. They're gonna come up with conspiracies now. You, you done fucked up, Hannah. 
Or maybe she was talking to Harvey. I don't know. She loved Henny. You know what I'm saying? You should love Henny too. But just give it some time. I, I don't love Henny, dude. Give it some time. Just give it some time. There's a cool little recap, man. Dude, I don't uh, no. All right, let me finish. Let's do go through the rest of the uh, the Reddit recap that or the Reddit. I yeah. still snipe you one of these days. Last, oh no, BTW. Uh, thank you, Dean. Appreciate that, homie. Hey, I would uh, I'd be down for that, dude. Just come by, and say what's up, homie. All right, let me see what we got. Dude, I appreciate that. You don't have to apologize to everyone, but Katie was actually nice to you. Bree was nice, but no apologies needed. Oops, be a friend and shut your stream off. Uh, I actually do feel bad for Katie. I'm not going to lie. She was a nice girl. I think Bree is, like, very much a... You say not anymore, but are you actually going to stick to it? <laughs> she literally stalks you, bro. She's always showing up to your house and your streams. Just tell yeah, her I don't want Tessie right? to come over anymore, dude. I did not appreciate what she did. Um, and I, and like, she, like, it's just weird, dude. Like, I don't, if she actually says she's trying to ruin my relationship, like, I'm not trying to fuck with that, dude. What do you mean? What do I say? This girl said your name to Yeah, I saw that. I, I watched this. But uh, what was I saying? Fucking. It only took five hours, so that's not bad. What was I going to Oh, yeah, I think Brie is like a clout chaser and like her personality is not the best. It's just fucking annoying. Easy, you're real one. But Katie's actually Three a nice girl. So I feel bad for Katie, but I don't feel bad for Brie. Uh, I don't think EBZ. EBZ, if you drank as much as we did, you'd be passed out. I think yesterday? Yeah. Oh. That's what the other guy said, too. And he passed out before I did. <laughs> So I mean I don't know about that, homie. We'll see. <clears throat> I mean you I'm don't you don't really drink, drink though. You don't. Yeah, I'm not a, like a heavy drinker. Well, you know when I start drinking, I have a way of maintaining. What do you mean, dude? <laughs> we left. <laughs> Shit, dude. What the, f what the fuck, dog? He's so loud, homie. He's just like mind. screaming, dude. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Alrighty. You can't um. The line to take you a long way. <laughs> <laughs> all right let's see here so we got check mark memes fucking drunk beside it that's great i'm glad you all really love when i throw my friends under the bus that sucks that sucks i don't i don't I, you guys should not allow me to throw friends under the bus what the hell everybody we all know nice to know it's bigger than hannah's clit what do you mean hannah's clit's not big i was trolling dude i've never seen her clit hold on Wait, uh, I don't know. I was just trolling EBZ, and then I guess some some things actually came to mind. I'm glad nobody donated about you because you don't want to know my true thoughts, EBZ. I was glad about that too. I'm just kidding. I like you. There's nothing I could have said that would have been bad. Uh, I don't know. I what did what did No Jumper say about Harvey, dude? Probably no, nothing, right? I drank the electrolyte stuff. Alright, let me, uh, let's see, let's get, let's look at this. Hello? What is this? The moment Ice realized he had no true friends. Hey, at least Scuff Steve Jobs came by to sit next to me. That's a good manager. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Okay. Two Tylenol is not going to help much either. You got to get hydration, dude. I'm going to sue you for slander. Okay. Evan's a horse, I guess. Tyler, the creator appreciation for telling TSA to fuck off. Don't really know what happened with that, but apparently he was next to my house. Talking shit about Harvey all night. Was Sam and Hannah talking shit about Harvey all night? I don't think so. I mean, were they? I don't really know. Let me see. Honest Andy appreciate. When did you take this? You should applaud me for my photography skills. I mean, that's a really good photo, but when did you take that, dude? Like, when we were getting fucking food? You had your food already. 
You went limp wrist on me. Why was I eating though? You was, you look like you was about to eat your phone. I mean, I was hungry, dude. Yeah, I was looking. This is breakfast, dude. I was literally looking at so many DMs. Were you guys in Atlanta or in Los Angeles? Uh, all right, look at the media. Let me see. Harvey got exposed. Let me see. Yeah, I was looking at the the shitstorm on my phone at this point. I was not having a good face. You're a fucking retard. Okay, whatever, dude. Stop. This was, I did not have a good face on my. I did not like how I looked. It's on his channel right now. I'll go check. Are you about to pull it up? What? No, it was a fucking gnome. A gnome? It was a gnome. What does that mean? Like, fu did, you fucking with me? What's a gnome? I feel like you're like you, the Discord sent you or something. All right, let me. You've never seen this? Look at him! And you've been gnomed! That's some stupid shit. <laughs> I agree with you, and that's why I hate it, because it's it's really just some dumbass shit, dude. Thank you for agreeing, finally. Um, that's, like, that's like some virgin shit. I mean, yeah, I hate it. Gnomes. It's like a midget Santa. It's like some gay shit, for real. I even have a gnome mask that I put on people and they piss me off. Suck Sam's dick, how to make millions. Suck Sam's dick, stream on Twitch. Betray CX Network, all the above. That's a good meme. Evan threatening to sue myself. <laughs> dude, you can't eat. You, dick. Dude, <laughs> imagine going to court and tell him and trying to convince the judge that you didn't suck dick for rent. Like, I mean, imagine that being like a, a That'd court be case. Extreme. That'd be some I meant like some stream material, dude. Um, Evan, you couldn't even pay rent. How the hell are you gonna pay a lawyer to sue me? Thank you, though. I appreciate that. Let me see. Thoughts about hands around locked up? Some people never got their lunch money back. In the show. Thanks to Harvey, EBZ leveled up in the community. Whatever that means. Probably the Henny. <laughs> okay. Uh, thoughts about Hand to Brandon locked up? I don't really know what happened. How did he get locked up? I don't know. I think somebody said he got swatted, but I don't even know anything about that. Let me see. Somebody was saying that he was playing helicopters on the car speaker with his phone on the floor. Was he? I don't know. I I don't know. I, I woke up and he was in jail, so I don't know. It's got to be hard. It's I mean, got to be hard when you got to commit crimes to get views, bro. That shit. I mean, that's, uh, that's, that's, that's true. Uh, that's his thing, though. This man slays more pussy than you. Change my mind. That's the conversation. Without consent. Okay, that's great. Um, Jesse actually tried to, without consent with me. Uh, e I'm just kidding. EBZ unbanned. Were you banned, EBZ? Damn, is that me? That's you, yeah. <laughs> were you banned? When were you banned? I don't remember being banned. Oh, really oh God, damn. I That's the most to be me. <laughs> I mean, we already have somebody printing my merch, but thank you, dude. We'll, uh, I mean, I'll look into wow. that for sure, though. Thank you, homie. It's pretty hard. You gotta get that on the shirt. For real. That's a Morpheus shit. It doesn't, it's not that cool, though. I don't like her. It's kind of I don't, cool. I really don't want her on stream anymore. I really don't. Like, I'm not gonna allow her to come by. Like, if she actually has this, like, low-key plan of, like, trying to homewreck me, I'm not gonna allow it, and I don't want her to come near me. Like, anymore, dude. As in, you know that person personally? You is need someone? You need this is Jesse the Slug. Yeah, dude, fuck it. I'm not going to allow her to Why do that. Why are you guys doing Jesse like that? Be because it's... What do you mean? Why are we doing her like that? It's about... It's accurate. It's, Jesse. it's yeah. accurate. What do you... It's like a, what, it's like a chipmunk or something, dude. It's fun. She's drinking some, like, pina colada or something. Yeah, why not, dude? South Park. Let me see. Then Tyler, the creator. Bro, you should have just shoved it in that his face anyways, TSA. That is not meeting Tyler the Creator. That is not meeting Tyler the Creator. This guy says this is Junior. That's, I saw Tyler the Creator. What's the difference? The big difference. 
What you most ever told me? Man, you ain't, you ain't no track suit work for TMZ, man. Man, even That's TMZ, even TMZ, TMZ has a, he a TMZ. direct statement. No, he TMZ Andy now. <laughs> right, that is not qualified. Dude, Tyler, that Tyler. Qualified. I would do the same thing, you though. You have to have said something to Tyler. Like, Tyler, I appreciate your music or something. So Tyler could say, yeah, but turn the camera off. That would have qualified. He just came in like, I would do the same. I would do the same thing, though. I would, like, I nah. would, I would 100% walk up to Tyler, the creator, and I'd be like, yo, what's up, dude? You like, would. Yeah, that was some starstruck CMZ. shit. He got starstruck. That's you would have come in with some interaction, which is you know, well. He tried to do the same thing though, but he got he got turned down and he took the turn down. He didn't even have to, his photo app pulled up. Like, see shit like that. Well, I mean, okay. If I if he I, if if he gets turned down and he just ignores the turn down, that's no, he harassment. Said something. He should have at least said something. You know what I mean? Because if you're gonna do it for the stream, thank you, guy. Then say something. But if you're gonna do it for personality. Then turn it down. I would have been like, yo, Tyler. I would have been like, yo, Tyler, what's up, dude? I like your music. Exactly. Say something. But that's what he said, right? He's just like, yo, Tyler. Yo. That's not the same thing. When yo, you Tyler. Want some real shit, if somebody ran up on me with a selfie stick, I, I would be definitely trying to turn you down. I wouldn't be trying to talk. Yeah, I'm man. definitely turning you, you down. Selfie Chat. Stick. You got a selfie stick. You I working. just jumped out of 300,000. EBZ <laughs> versus Harvey. A fucking selfie stick? Fuck no. Which ones do you guys... Fuck with more. EBZ versus Harvey. He's just trying to fuel the propaganda. EBZ no, because this. Who? No, because there's uh, this guy donated says uh, Harvey now EBZ leveled up in the community. And then EBZ and Harvey best on CX. What's up, EBZ Jr. She has no plans. Don't try and look good for Kimberly. Jesse deserves to be on stream. I don't even have an emote like. We can get you an emote. Um, I'm you, we, we, the dead eye emote or something. Oh, that makes sense. Um, I, actually, that makes sense. He's not starstruck then. No, I wasn't. Dude, my male instincts. I was so drunk. I wasn't blaming my male instincts on anything, dude. Oh, yeah. It's a daily and I would not have sex with Jesse. Dude, if I was single, I would not have sex with Jesse. I wouldn't. Would you guys have sex with Jesse? Like, if you're single? What kind of question is... Would you have sex with her? Well, I'm going to drink first. I'm, I'm busy right now. We lit! <laughs> you would actually have sex with Jesse. Nah. Nah, hell nah. Yeah, you would. Nah, hell Bro, you tried to fuck the prostitute from in Florida, dude. That was a different story. And you tried to fuck like a bunch of... You fucked that one chick with the face tattoo in Vegas as well. That All right, this story. is a real question. <laughs> no, this After is me <laughs> and Ness <laughs> fucked her. Uh, would you, would you fuck Jesse? Literally at her, you got, you were third in line, dude. That how is that, how is that a different story? Would Jesse's cleaner than that. Her wig yeah, on or off. Good guys making a living. Chalab Jr. said, what up? Jess wears a wig? Yeah, would you fuck her with a wig on or I've off? I've never seen her with a wig off. I didn't know she had a wig. Me neither. But, uh, dude, what's the difference between getting sloppy thirds on a crackhead First in Vegas? All, I, didn't, I didn't get sloppy thirds. And Jesse. I didn't get sloppy thirds. But you did though. You even fucked Corinne. I didn't fuck Corinne. Bro, you fucked Corinne or something. See, that's a problem with you. You don't understand who's sitting before you. See, who's sitting before you is not a roach. You're describing roach behavior. Slappy thirds. Fucking Corinne who had chlamydia. <laughs> what do I look like? Keep in mind. Why were you cuddling with her then? Stream just the other day. Why were you cuddling with her then? It was good for content. I learned from the best. Bro, you did not cuddle with Kurt. By the way, while I was cuddling with her, you guess, cuddling for guess, views? Guess who? You did not cuddle oh, her for views. Man, don't on. say that. Are you cuddling for views, man? Come on, Don't be man. saying shit like that. I didn't cuddle for Bro, views. Bro, it reminds me of what I said about I Haley. I was just cuddling time. her. And Bro, I some you, donations. you did you not cuddle for I'll, don't know. You did not cuddle <laughs> her and then get no sex out of it. What the fuck you mean, dude? Okay, let me tell you something. So you guess, need to tell guess me. Guess who was calling her at the time? Who? You! What? While, while I was what? so called cuddling for Dono, <laughs> Man. you were calling and inviting oh, her over. You were calling her over saying, hey, come over. So this is this is your story. And she was, she was like, oh, I need to talk to you. I was not guess, trying guess to fuck Corinne. Excuse I me? I wasn't trying to fuck either. Guess what I did when she said, she was like, oh, I need, I said, Corinne, go outside and make these phone calls. And uh, good night. Clean. 
How bro. Much, how much money did you get in Donos? You know, it was 354. How how is that? Much. How is that? Yeah, what is it? So you didn't have to fuck her? Hell no. Nah. What's considered so roach behavior? Fifty four dollars and you didn't for for to... hugging the lady in bed. Easy. What's considered I'll roach behavior? Like why why is sloppy fuck, thirds? Why is fucking Corinne sloppy roach thirds. behavior? Sloppy what thirds. What, why is what? Use. Why is having sex with Corinne roach behavior? No, having sex with Corinne is not roach behavior. First of all, roach behavior is having sex with Corinne. While she has chlamydia, that's worse behavior. Number but if she one. didn't have chlamydia, then number two, then you'd having be fine. sex with Corinne on some so basically stream you, shit. You that's just monetize behavior. that bitch. I monetize the situation. It wasn't a bitch. I you monetized, monetized her chlamydia. You took advantage of her much. physical ailment, and you made money from unsuspecting teenagers. I'm sorry. And overage, that's middle age fault. people. I'm, I'm guilty. ABZ, yeah. you know what else is roach behavior? <laughs> You're a the twisted round was fuck. Dude. You know what else what is? Did you want me to you know what else is roach behavior? What else? Showing is? your third ball. That's not roach behavior. That is a roach behavior. I walk around with my third ball showing. <laughs> How is that not roach behavior? That's not my normal. My third ball is showing right now. <laughs> Big black ball. This one. Bingo. <laughs> <laughs> it's showing right this moment. Fucking in. Why not, dog? <laughs> What? I mean, I, I, mean, I mean, you make sense with that, but you it's... actually can lick this and gargle, tea bag and all that. Are you, just, bro? Are you telling me? Okay, what about you? What about the girl in Hawaii? You didn't try to get with her. Jasmine, sweetheart, Jasmine. Why would you want to get with? Ja See, Jasmine is one of those girls that, when you understand, this guy's like, don't lie. You were definitely all up on Corinne off stream at Isis. At Isis. Yeah, I for I remember you were like making out with her. ISIS? No. <laughs> yes. No, 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 no. What do you mean? Well, it doesn't matter if I was making out with her here and there. It's well, she, while matter. she had chlamydia. Hey man, you need some more energy, bro. <laughs> These niggas are trying to get me. These niggas are trying to get me talking. You need some more energy. Keep man. in mind, I'm a strong motherfucker, so you know, Hennessy's not gonna make me talk more than I want it. I don't know about that one, bro. When you get drunk, you get crazy. <sighs> okay. Now. Uh, so you monetize your chlamydia. Guilty of that. You papertized her desires to have sex with you. <laughs> I tell Harvey J to stop screaming. <laughs> Harvey, I'm stop stop screaming, Harvey. I got you, bro. <laughs> oh my gosh. We <laughs> live! <laughs> missed it. Fuck it, dude. Um, should I use Jesse as a vomit bucket? No, thank you. All right, here we go. Anything is possible, and here it's uh, apparently Hannah oh, shit. sucking. Har that's, oh that's, shit! That's the first thing I saw. When I looked at Reddit. That picture? Yeah, it's apparently Harvey sucking. Uh, I'll just put take this off the screen though, for real. Harvey wow! Suck. When did this happen? Like it's not real. It's like photoshopped. It's photoshopped. I was wishing it was real. Yeah, it's not real though. Like it's why are you why are you wishing no. that's real, dude? How you know what are you that? saying? I Hold just, up. You first know, of all, how you know it's in not the name real? You was drunk. Shit. In the name of you was drunk. How you know it's not real? You weren't even there. Cut. Okay, because it's clearly okay. It's. I mean, the, it's clearly a Photoshop. You about to ask her if it's real? Yeah. Boy, you hell. Is that her calling? Yeah. Answer. Let's 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 get to the bottom of this blowjob. Hannah. He's harassing. Harvey Harvey he's J a, says it's he's real. A, he's harassing you for views. What's real? Harvey J said you guys did shit and that's real. No, not did shit. Show her the picture. Absolutely right not. I would never. I say, no, show her the views. picture. That's. You can't relate until he shows you the picture. Look, the picture shows I mean, I think she, I think she would know, dude. No, she doesn't remember. Right, look. She was probably drunk. You milking this shit, bro. Did oh she? my gosh. All right, you, check it out. you fucking you for donating to I say I'm That's being hungry can be homie. That's what? I would never. Yeah, no. EBZ said he wished it was real. No, 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 I didn't say Why? that. I did not. <laughs> Literally, he said that. I did not say that. Why would you say that? I didn't say that. You know me. You know me better than that. Yo, Ice, that. you got a glass full of milk. Dude, you, okay, you were like, I wish it was real. Oh, no, why? Mike, now, I don't think I was talking about you if I said Yo, that. Yo, EBZ got a I, secret I, th desire. I might have thought that he was talking about someone else if I said that. EBZ want to be a porn director. That's his second, his second hope and dream in life. Like my fourth passion. He can direct me and Sam. You want to do that? Yeah! Are you kidding me? Where are we applying? 
What the hell's wrong with hockey. you, dude? Are you kidding me? I'll be Sorry for harassing oh, you, no, Hannah. That's not, she's not, come on. We're having a it's great fine. conversation. This is actually promising. Bye. Hannah, Bye. I'm sorry. She was just telling me about the script with her and Sam, and I had to direct it. You just fucked up my opportunity. I just had my first directing opportunity, and you hung the phone up. You would really drug the porno between Sam and Hannah? Are you kidding me? Why would not? Why? I mean, that seems gay. We live! Far from gay. How? That's you're watching a guy fuck no, a girl. No, I'm telling. <laughs> you're Sam, literally the cuck. Sam, no. You're literally watching Think it. You're it. telling them what to do. That's literally some cuck shit. Okay, mind call you. It. Call it that. Mind you. Call it that. Call it that. I'll play that position. I'll be the cuck. <laughs> what? Why would you want to be the cuck? What is wrong with you? I'll be the cuck. Let's do it. I'll be the cuck. If you want to call it that, yeah, I'll be the cuck. Why would you want to be a I'm cuck, though? This porn. But why, though? What do you mean, why? Because it was offered to me. I didn't wake up here saying, hey, I want to be the cuck. Easy. Oh, why, would why you watch me have sex? But with who? With anybody. Do you know the guys Carl Jimenez with family happily married with kids and he is also on multiple gay hookup sites? What is his name? <laughs> you please acting like I'm wrong. I have no idea. I don't know who you, what you're talking about. Um, would you watch me have sex with, no. any, with anybody? Normally speaking, hell fucking no. I don't want to be involved with your sexual exploits. So, but, but depending on who you're with. Play the clip where EBZ gets I might sucked off of the gas station for the clip. How she buy initiates this conversation. So yes. you're so you're saying that you want to get with Hannah, but since you can't, you're gonna watch no! it. Oh, I don't remember saying that you motherfucker. You're reading too much into the conversation. That's literally what, literally what you just said. No, That's what no, it no. means. That's what what I'm trying to tell you is this. Depending on who it is, I might want to exercise my directing abilities. Depending on who it is, right? It's kind of like if you were Snoop and you asked me to freestyle, I might want to freestyle. But on my own or among my homies, I might not want to freestyle. But if you were Snoop and you asked me to freestyle and I don't freestyle, I might just want to freestyle. You see what I'm saying? Like what? Certain people bring out the as an up uh, up. Uh, an aspect in your abilities. I'm what are you able, saying, I'm bro? I'm able to direct. So once proposed, I feel the need to express my talent. Basically, you're saying you want Hannah. I no, got you. Not. You literally just said <laughs> yeah, you want Hannah. That's far from what I said. You might need to give Sam another slap if you want to make that happen. Some quality character work. What do you say? I will never watch your streams. I watch clips, though. Post He's saying if you're you've been embracing the meme recently and put some real quality character work. I still never watch your streams. I watch clips though, post edited clips. You should post edited clips in your channels. What are you saying? Works for me. All right, the, what the okay, foggy dude. No, I'm down for that. Uh, that's some roach behavior now. <laughs> that's what. That's some roach behavior though, yeah. homie. That's not that roach. I mean, behavior. imagine I'm looking. Hey, all right, if we, I mean, hey, imagine I look in the corner, hey, EBZ staring at us, fucking. Pump your brakes, just so you know. Sounds good in conversation. What? No, I don't want you watching me have sex. Sounds good in conversation. No, it doesn't even sound good in conversation. You you brought the conversation up. I just responded to it. But you responded with the wrong answer. What's the right answer? No. No, I don't want to watch you ah, have sex. Come on, fuck that answer. That's that that ends the conversation. I want to know what happened. Harvey, down the henny bottle. You have to blow EBZ into a henny anima. I'm not part of that. Unsubscribe. Any response to that one? You're a virgin. <laughs> Foggy, dude. Okay, fuck it, bro. Let me see. Um, Another day, another L with Uber. Let's see, what is it? Me and Harvey J. Oh. You look like both sides of Paul's personality. Harvey is his alcohol and chillin' side, but he uses his teen healthy side. Love you guys. I don't know if I'd say those the, Harvey and a EBZ combined are my personality, but thank you, dude. That's an interesting. You must be high as fuck, homie. Uh, let me see. Lightweight EBZ drunk, bro. EBZ is fucking drunk. He doesn't want to admit it, but he is. Why would you say I'm drunk? What because you're you're acting crazy, dude. Acting crazy. And then Uber over here talking about three. These girls got laid. Awesome deep throat artists. Wow. I mean, I've looked up some weirder shit though, so that's not a big deal. EBZ, you're actually drunk right now. Why would you say? Because you're fucking, you're saying, okay, EBZ, would you ever get with a man? Where's that part from? You told me that the no, other day. No, no. Where's that part? We talked about a lot of things before, me and my drunk self. 
This part was not part of that drunk conversation. You told, you told me a few nights ago that you would actually have sex with a man. Which night ago? What do you mean? The one night where you came over with the flamethrower. I didn't come over with the flamethrower. Hey, you came over and we used the flamethrower. When you used the flamethrower. You see, you see just in that sense alone, you made mistakes. Huh? You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. In yeah, that, I made in a that sentence alone in your dude, I'm just, I just don't feel good right in now. I, my, I can't talk very well, but... Whose you, fault is that? Three if days... If you're making mistakes about the actuality of life, whose fault is that? Three days ago, you told me... Now you now you know how many days it was. Because I'm too lazy to say it. Three right, days ago, you said you wanted to have sex with a man. No. You easy. Stop said, being so black. You said, a few days, you said three days ago, I told you that I want to have sex with a man. What was the concept of the conversation? You were just. <laughs> Are you playing? <laughs> Hold on, let me just wait until your media stops playing. I could go. Talk. I said, okay, I brought it up, same question. I was like, would you have sex with a man? And you were drunk, and you were like, yeah, that's crazy, though. Like, exactly like that. Was that on stream? No, it was off stream. We were drinking. You're me? like, yeah, you were like, yeah. We that's were drinking. That's crazy, though. Three, three days ago. Because, you know, what's funny about that actual statement is that three days ago, you went out with a flamethrower. Yeah, it was after the stream. What's funny about that, though, is that after the stream that I remember, I drove home and did some writing. But you don't remember because we were drinking. Well, the stream remembers because it was a continuous stream. No, because you put this phone in your pocket, dude. I actually didn't. You didn't did. remember. I, drew, I streamed from here home. Why are you lying? You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Why are you lying right now? Why are you deflecting <laughs> you don't the conversation? Know what the fuck you're talking about, Paul? You're literally... you got you just got exposed. Let me ask you. You're this deflecting question. the conversation, what did you bro. Do after you, the stream, you're acting so you, guilty what right did now. What you stream about three days ago? Do you even remember what stream we had three days ago? The flamethrower. And that's when we were drinking, and you said you would have sex with a man. Just so you know, when it came to the flamethrower, we had two flamethrower streams. Yeah. Which one are you talking about? The first one. Mind you. The flamethrower stream. The flamethrower stream that you should relate to will be the second one because that's the last time I saw you. Which would which have which has better probabilities of being three days ago. Okay, maybe it was four days ago. I don't you know. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Say with lit. Maybe. Say with lit. Maybe it was four days ago. It doesn't really matter, dude. That, that shit ain't lit. Basically, <laughs> what I, basically what I was saying. Double down, doubling down on the lit. Basically, what I was saying is that you said you would be with a guy, and I was gonna hook you up with a man today. Obviously, you don't know what you're talking about. So you must not have been me. I actually oh, had no. a man coming over today for you. Yeah, it must not have been me. His name's Martin. It must not have been me. No, it was definitely you. You're the only guy that was around. Nah, you, you missed. You missed the, your entire. And remember the whole grind on me, EBZ from Track Suit Andy. Tracksuit. If I bring Tracksuit in here, can he grind on you? That's Tracksuit's conversation. Tracksuit, if you're watching the stream, can you please uh, come in here and grind on EBZ? I'm not part of that conversation. <laughs> you might use my name. Boys there are a lot of imposters in this world. Nothing. There are a lot of imposters in this world. I don't well, think you know what you're talking about, Paul. Bottom line. Yeah! What happened? What that's, you your, that's your voice. <laughs> That's he your, that's uh, do he said do the EBZ voice again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Dude, you you laugh like a metronome, dude. You're you you're so into your music, you literally laugh like a metronome. That's what I'm always thinking about. Like you you're the music is overtaking you. I saw the impression that you did of me a few days ago. It was very accurate. Actually. It was and not accurate. It was actually very accurate. And I thought about it. Because I was, I was like, minding my business, and it hit me. I was like, look at the shirt. Look at the jacket. Oh, got my jacket what, back. What comes after the jacket? Can I have my shirt back? Yes, of course. Of course. <laughs> I got you. So I was like, what usually comes after you see the shirt and the jacket? What do you say? EBZ really liked that big piece of cooked meat for him and wanted more, so he sucked off ice off stream. What is all this gay? Where is this gay content coming from? <laughs> Let me ask you something. Would you say a lot of your followers are gay? Uh, yeah, like 95%. How? Come. Because people like you who want to have sex with men. Are you gay? I'm straight. I have a girlfriend. Have you ever had intercourse with a guy? Yes. Well, not intercourse, but a blowjob. Okay, so you are gay. No, that's bi-curious, maybe. No. Not gay. Same thing. 
Very curious. That means it all depends on the times. If you were in jail and you hadn't had sex in six months, you might revert to the next best thing. I mean, probably. If I was in jail with, like, no sex, I'd probably fuck a dude. Like, that's, bas- that's, ten- that's pretty much what happens. That doesn't make you gay. It makes you having no other options. If you were in jail for five years... for what? To get your nut. If you were in jail for five years, you wouldn't take a blowjob from no. some dude? Why? Because you're, you're nut. Because you're in jail for five years? What do you well, mean? The concept of fucking, for me, in my mind... You know, let's talk about this. Let's talk about this. The concept of... I don't even know what, what clip you're talking about, but thank you. I don't know what I don't know what clip you're talking about. A gas station wanted to charge me twenty dollars for for four dollars of gas. Twenty dollars, as in the gas canister, because I ran out of gas. Uh huh. Fuck it, dude. What were you saying? So you wouldn't have sex with a guy after five years in prison? No, I wouldn't. Well, the idea of having sex. What what does that mean to you? Is it just fucking, busting a nut? Yes. To me, if there are two things attached to it. Busting a nut in a girl. But if there's to no you, girl, if there's no girls like around, though. Layer, huh? If there's busting no, a nut. if there's no <laughs> girls so you around. You fuck a cow if it came down to it. I mean, yeah. If there's, if there's no <laughs> girls around, like, what is it? Like, yeah, you got it. You have other options, bro. Like, I fucked my so dog, like, fuck whatever. A, you would fuck your dog. I have fucked my dog. You would fuck a Hennessy bottle. I would fuck a Hennessy bottle. Dude, I had sex with a banana peel. And my couch. Tell us about that. Do you know how to make a homemade flashlight? <laughs> Tell us about the banana peel fucking. That's weird shit. Microwave? Let's get this right. So you ate the banana, then you put the peel in? No, I put the banana in the trash. So I wasn't hungry. I microwaved the fucking banana peel, and I fucked it because it was warm. Nice. And then I, this is how you make a homemade flashlight. You get a fucking, uh, like a sandwich bag, put some lotion inside of it. You roll a towel around the sandwich bag. Boom. Nice and tight. You got a flashlight. You fuck the towel. Like, I don't understand. That's deep. <laughs> Not really, bro. It's just like, I don't know. It's just like some real shit. Come to San Antonio during Fiesta. Good content, bro. Dream hat coming in Austin in a few months. Uh, <laughs> dude, fuck Dream Hack. I don't want to. I, I, I don't know if I want to go back there. They, I don't want to be on fucking like security watch for fucking stupid reasons. Um, post removed. Still got to address it, Paul. Yeah, we addressed it. I don't know what the hell is going on with that. To be honest, um, Uber was live today during a Reddit recap. EBZ was live today during a Reddit recap. CX News Reddit recap. Oh, everyone's doing Reddit recaps today. Yes. Of course. I mean, I, I'm doing, I'm not doing much today because I'm not feeling the best, but you know, actually tomorrow we're doing a hide and seek stream tomorrow. I'm going to have money taped onto me. Um, actually, so if you live in LA, listen to this, I'm going to have money taped onto me. Um, and we're going to be doing a hide and seek stream similar to how last one went. But this time I think what I'm going to do is work with Phineas and we're going to make a map that we're going to put on the screen with a radius and uh, sort of like, uh, I don't know, like Fortnite or something. And the radius is going to slowly close in. And if you find me, as the, uh, the bigger the radius, the more money you get. If that makes any fucking sense to you. Uh, so that's what we're going to do tomorrow. It's going to be good. Let me see. Listen now. Just take the bag and forget everything. That's not accurate at all. No, it was a Christmas. How many bags did you bought for her? Dude, it was, I bought her one bag for Christmas. It was a Christmas present. Was it the same when you saw it in uh, Hawaii? No, I, it was, well, no. We looked at the bags in Hawaii, but I didn't actually buy one there. Uh, I tell EBZ he has to give PD a cream, a cream filled hole once. Otherwise, EBZ will have to do two dudes, one cup with burger. Yeah, not, not, doesn't relate to me. No, I, uh, yeah, I, it was a Christmas present. Like, what the fuck? I don't know. How much is the bag, by the way? How much is the bag? Why do you ask that? Well, because we went to the store. All the bags were like 1,000, 14. Did you get like a 2,000? Because remember, I pulled out some bags, which were like 24, 25. So did you get the 15 or the 1,000 or the 700? Because it's still balling, but yeah, obviously. Well, is 1,400 not good enough for you? 14 is awesome. Like the 700 dollars was, was crazy. So you got a 14, but was it a nice 14 or the average? Because average is like, there are a lot of Louis va- Louis bags out there. Did you get like a different, did you get a Sam's advice or my advice? It was like, uh, I think it was like 1800. Was it a Sam advice? No, it was an advice that her friend gave me. Oh, okay, good. 
Yeah, dude. It was like, uh, like what you mean, dog? Like it was. A... <laughs> yeah, what does it matter to you? I you see Sam over here talking about. Get this one. Get this one. Eyes, eyes. I think you need to get this one. Yeah, Sam had some good suggestions, but I just asked her friend what what she thought I should get, and so I just got that one. Um, fuck it, dude. Let me see. Eight one point eighteen k gift incel. Not about incel. What do you mean incel, dude? It was literally Christmas, bro. What are you saying? I got my I gave my fucking parents some good shit too. Like, what are you saying? What you gave your parents? Um. Well, I just gave him cash because I didn't have anything to get him. No, I gave him like two grand. It's a great Christmas gift. What did they say? I mean, it was uh, pretty good. They said they uh, they needed it after paying for something. Like they were paying some some bills off, and they said they were like kind of short and stuff. So I just gave them the money. But how did they, like, how did they respond? Was it one of those, wow, or was it one of those, thank you? I mean, they just said thank you. Oh, they gave it a thank you. They didn't give it what? Well, what do you want them to say? They're just like, right, thank you. I mean, when you when you're selling plenty clip of a year to me long. Two grand, I'll be like, wow. But granted, they bring on a relationship. Well, I mean, they. I mean, I don't know. My parents are just like, yeah, they're like, thank yeah. you. I'm not. Well, I'm not fucking balding, dude. Oh, do you have any of this? Just give me the four dollars of gas. It's not yeah, I do. Problem. On the shelf Fine. up there. Don't make it your problem. Why the fuck would you? I wonder where you got the idea for our hide and seek offline house, you? perhaps. Why test, why test. Why are you also gonna tell me that? Only after I walk in the struggle to do it. You, you were standing on this corner. I'm on that corner. EBZ, floor. can you turn your media off, please? Can you turn your media off, please? Uh, did I get the hide and seek idea from the offline house, like offline TV house? No, you're, you, dude. What are you talking about? You're crazy. We did a hide and seek stream literally like seven or eight months ago. Um, but you wouldn't know that because I mean you're clearly a new fag, uh, and we're just revisiting the idea and making it a little bit, uh, you know, a little bit more detailed out than the last time. I'm not fucking balding, dude. Y'all need to shut the fuck up, dude. Like, my hair is fine, bro. Like, what the fuck? Like, y'all are nuts. <laughs> Less hair than wreckful. Y'all are. I hate. I hate. Shut. Just stop. Shut the fuck up, dude. The boy, Henny couldn't couldn't stand the. Uh... You know what I say. We have a lot better people in our in our life right now than we did like four or five months ago, dude. Like everyone in my life right now is so much like better, just higher quality. Um, when I was hanging out with like four four, four or five months ago, it's a lot of homeless people. I didn't like that shit, so it's uh it was, it's really nice. EBC, I really like you. No, I appreciate you, brother. I really do. And I think you're really improving yourself as a as a streamer. I try, man. I Not only as serious. a streamer, but as a person as well. Like no, I take it serious, and I take the situation serious. You know. I remember uh, when we first met, you were very like embarrassed of streaming, and you really didn't want to stream. Now you, now you, now you, you embrace it, bro. You walk around, you walk around with crazy selfie sticks, and like you just say shit. It doesn't matter. I try, I try. I'm still working my way into that whole saying whatever you want. But um, that looks scuffed. I know. <laughs> yeah. No, but I, I appreciate the situation. You know, one thing that make, that helps me appreciate the situation even more is the fact that I know the people who watch me are there regardless of what I do do, right? So, regardless of what I do, they're always there. So, it's like it gives me more incentive to want to please them. Does that make sense? Because if you were here just because I was doing great shit, my wife is not always great. But if you're here regardless, then, of course, I want to make it great. Right. First time donating here, Paul. Been watching since Dead Man's streams. Love the content every day. Keep up the good work, dude. Thank you, Andrew. I appreciate that, homie. Uh, no, you're good. That's good shit. Um, what was I gonna fucking say? Oh, yeah, you're not wearing EBZ shirts every day anymore, too, which is good. <laughs> you think that's good? You, you, you're having more of a style now. That's more than just, like, follow EBZ on... On this particular... On Spotify fucking t-shirt, dude, that you wore every single day. Funny you say that, because uh, I'm actually wearing one of those on the inside. I feel it. I just don't have to show it. You know, okay, never time mind. Time. I, 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 never mind. I take it back then. <laughs> Jesse's when coming. Comes. How do you guys know Jesse's coming? No, I don't want. I don't want Jesse to come, dude. Like, y'all is, she, is, she, is like y'all is she like streaming this or something? Like, and y'all like not like I'm not gonna let her come in here, dude. I'm gonna grill her. I'm gonna grill her for like ten minutes. Be like, 
you're what the, like what the fuck and then i'm gonna tell her to leave like you know what i mean that's what's gonna happen if she comes i'm gonna grill her i'm gonna roast her and then i'm gonna tell her to leave yeah. because like that's like i don't want I don't, I don't want her fucking ass uh, to come in here and, like, be all homewrecky. Like, that's not cool. What time am I going to do the hide-and-seek thing tomorrow? Well, tomorrow, we're probably going to do it when there's sunlight out, so I'd say, like, 3 p.m. It's probably when we're going to do it. How are you doing it? Are you doing it for viewers to find you? Yeah, so I go out. I hide somewhere and I walk around or whatever. Viewers have to come find me. They get money. They find me. First one to find me gets money type shit. So, um, you know, that's basically what, what we're going to what we're gonna do tomorrow. Sort of like an idea that we had eight months ago, but it's a little bit more ironed out this time around. So That's pretty cool. It's Sniping with a point. Sniping with a reason. Or with a purpose. Who's in the living room right now? Uh, SJC tracksuit. The interview guy. Oh yeah, let me go talk. He wants to do. Uh, you can stay in here and do an interview too. He wants to interview us again for uh, the day of the weekly one. I bet. Me too. You're my favorite, Andy. You're a me tour. You're a me tour, huh? I know. I'm eating the vape. I'm kind of starving. Actually, no. But I can use some food soon. Bet easy. False life is firing out of control. Well, come on, man. Help it. Help put it back. The busy. Oh, okay. Try, man. Juice is good, man. Red juice is good. It almost feels like cake. Capital B's, who's on site? One of these roaches? I know he bees and B. Don't worry about telling me. You were a roach from day one when you showed up with that name. Tracksuit. A-B-Z. I got the baby gun. Tracksuit. You guys didn't even see I what did. Tracksuit just did. Oh, oh shit. Oh, what the saw, fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. What you the know that's going to be on Reddit like Oh, shit. What the fuck? <laughs> Hold, on. Hold on. What the fuck was that? Tracksuit just tried to grind on me, man. <laughs> But he did it so poorly, bro. If you're going to grind on EBZ, then grind on EBZ. Don't grind on Don't show him how to grind on me. <laughs> what? You were grinding on me at the motherfucking shift. What do you mean? Look at this shit. What is this? Wait, what is that? What is that? No one, is, no one, is that? No one cares what that is. Grind on me, EBZ. Come on, bro. What the fuck is going on over here? What did you think about it when he said These that last time? These motherfuckers, huh? You thought it was gay when he said that? I wasn't thinking about it. I was too much in the vibe. I was like... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> These niggas, man. Why are you so scared of it? Because I don't want a meme of me getting grind on, grind on like <laughs> hey, two man, guys. Like it. What kind of meme is that? Uh, I mean, I, it's just funny, dude. I know what these motherfuckers are waiting. They're they going to clip before you know it. Yeah, I've been watching you for a while and noticed that you have been swatted over five times. I do a favor by affecting the info of the hacker. Uh... Okay, I mean, I already got all that a long time ago, but thank you, dude. I appreciate that, homie. All right, let me see. Give me a sec. Sweet. Send me the album. Company. Oh, Petey just uh, texted me. He said he, you should direct his porno. No. What's the difference? That's a no-no. What's the difference? <laughs> 
That's a no no. I don't want to be in that room. Why? What's the difference? I don't want to know the day of the shoot. I do not want to be involved. Why? Are you, do you not like Petey? I don't want to hear about it. Hey, do you not like him? That's that gay shit. Street. I am not I part of that. The, the only reason I'm going to direct your porno is because, well, I'm Milwaukee. I don't know. No plans to, but thank you. I'm um, a nice guy. Why are you going to direct my porno? I'm a nice guy. You know, two, a couple ones that do their thing. They need a cameraman. Adrian time. left, by the way. Um, Dude, that's so weird. Do you know? That's so weird, dude. No, it's a couple. couple it's, if a couple I'm, needs I'm someone not, to record, I'll be the I'm one. Helping, you know how weird that sounds? I'm helping you guys. Yeah, that's that's not weird. You should invite a different CX streamer onto your stream each day. You need to interact with them in order to grow the network. I mean, EBZ, has your stream been growing? Has your stream been growing? C R O A G in here. Yeah. I R O A G loves you too. Let me see. Gay BZ emote. What is this? Oh my god. Oh, this is a good emote. Oh yeah, I liked it. Chat, what do you think about this one? I actually like this emote a lot. <laughs> are you into, the, I mean, gay pride, are you into that? No, I'm not into gay pride. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think that'd be a, would you not want that emote in the chat? Nope, nope, nope. I have a better one. Dude, that's so funny, homie. Jesse said you owe her money from baiting donos. Dude. <laughs> Jesse said so? Jesse literally lets everybody bait donuts around her, like Sam, me, well, I haven't everybody. Done like she, she needs to be a better businesswoman. She should come over. I'll bait some no, donuts. No, no. <laughs> Maybe you can. No, you keep her outside, bro. On your stream, I don't. I did not. Maybe she can come over to my stream, and then I'll, you know, bake some donuts that way. You know. <sighs> Hold on, let me see. I mean, you know, come over to my spot. You know. EBZ, you should actually have sex. You should actually have sex with her, though. You should take. You should have sex with her and take her. Take her to where? I don't know. Your dick. Like, what do you mean? Oh, okay. Just unless, unless you're gay, right? Yeah, I guess. I, I guess that would be my. Pro those would be my proving grounds. The sex cult. <laughs> I need me a sex cult. <laughs> Wait. Look. Wait. I need my own sex cult. I just can't afford it. A sex cult is something you have to do. With. I just looked to see if she... Thank God the chat's trolling, but... Does she live with Sam? Oh. Whoa. What was that, that video? That, that, no, that no, 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 no. See, you just, now you're taking it back. Now you say you would do it with her, but... No, I mean, the, the, that video was just different. It was, the lighting was... Does she live with fucking Sam? Like, she's, that's literally where he lives, dude. What's up, guys? Oh, hey, Gary, how you how doing? You What's up, EBC? How was, uh, how was getting you, how the fuck did you get, dude, you, how'd you get Uber out of his cave? We have to call him Woober. Woober? He won. Uh, basketball, is he, he good? He won basketball. How did he win? RV Andy versus Woober. Well, RV Andy, you think RV Andy no, knows about he's, fucking he's basketball? RV Andy, and he's Woober. Wow. That's it. Right, I mean, Woober but he, he's taking so many L's, it's going to be hard to call him Woober, dude. She lives in a complex building. Why would she yeah, move in that? Won. Why would she yeah. move in that building? That's a very expensive building. EBZ yeah, should have a guys. video part two of the robot dance on EBZ. EBZ, why are you always trying to fight my robot? Fuck your robot. You hate that robot, dude. <laughs> that robot, you listen. Hate that robot. Give me, can I get a one-on-one -on -one with the robot? Like, the last time I was here, he slapped me. I didn't even do anything about him. I just put him in the, in the fucking bathroom. You want to fight the robot? I want a one-on-one -on -one with the robot. Well, he, he's got the fucking, like, the arms of a fucking, like, autistic child. Well, so it doesn't even talk, count. he talks shit with arms of an autistic sh child. If, so a, if, 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 if there was some Down Syndrome child that was talking shit, would you slap them? I would slap them. Because even in your Down Syndrome <laughs> state, you need to learn a few lessons. <laughs> what are you <laughs> saying, dude? <laughs> What are you saying, you bro? You're going to slap a Down syndrome child? Shit. That means you haven't learned a few lessons in this life. Even in Down syndrome, you can feel a, a punch. Dude, what is wrong with you, bro? You're going to slap some Down syndrome kid? What the fuck? You wouldn't slap a Down syndrome child who was talking shit to you? No, I would I would be like, okay, and, let, and just drop it. Because, you know, they, 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 they probably wouldn't be able to know what's going on. The back counter would definitely let them know what's going on. <laughs> okay, who would, who would you not slap? Like, what would be out of your exception here? Um, older people, parents, 
You know, parents, all the people. Okay, so what if there was some thirty-year-old man to, that was a parent of a child? If and he was mad about shit. something involving his child, I'll just understand that he's trying to protect another person. But if he has his kids with him, you slap him still? No, that's what I'm saying. Parents, no, nah, because I know you're just trying to, you just you're trying to be all you can be for the person in front of you. I'll let you do that. You can have that one. So you wouldn't slap a guy because he has kids, but you would no, slap a Down trying, syndrome child. Because he's trying to be... Listen, it's all about the intent, right? The parent is intending to make something right. I'm trying to be right. You know, Scuff Jim Carrey's a, Jim is is a parent. Shit. Scott Jim Carrey has a kid, nah. and, Wait, no and you and you, you punched him. You no, did punch him. It's not no parent. You don't, don't want to no disrespect him. Gary's still a soy boy. Number one, no. I don't want to. Oh, no, he's a good guy. We don't. This guy said you're a soy boy, but no, that's my boy. Okay. So man, <laughs> <laughs> why'd you why'd you slap Scott Jim Carrey then? Oh yeah, he called you Scott Jim Carrey. Who did? EBZ. No, I didn't. I said it was in you the You want to me and Scuff Jim Carrey? I said it was in the I'm living room, and he said Scuff Jim Carrey and fucking nah, Adrian. And that. He really meant you, though. He doesn't even know the difference. Why are you such a dick rider, man? Like, why are you jumping on his nuts? Mind you. Backstabbing me. Not backstabbing, but going against me. I didn't call you that, and I just told you that. Why are you jumping on what he said? Yeah, I'm oh. talking to you. He said he called me Scott Jim Carrey. And I just said, I just said I, I gotta him. pick, I gotta believe somebody. So you pick him. I did. And I'm saying. Maybe next time I'll pick you. Oh, well, all right, I'll wait. You know? I'll wait to see. Let's Maybe next see time. ABC, how do you, how do you get, how does someone get you to the certain point of slapping? No, being very, just, just being disrespectful, you know? Unnecessarily disrespectful. Do you I can understand. Would you I can understand, if, you I can understand if we have an argument. Huh? Record me and my girlfriend having sex. I'm not going to go with no. Because he says he's down for it. Yeah. Would you record me and your girlfriend having sex? Mm, do you think that's what I would do? I know. I, do, you, I, do, you, I, do you think I, that's I, what I would do? Listen, I like respecting people's opinions. I have no idea. Do you think opinion. that I'm Ricky, the type of guy? Yo, EBZ, Ricky. Let you do that. Ricky Berwick says he would fight you. Do you think? Out of respect for you. No, I wouldn't. Right. Right. I wouldn't want to put words in your mouth. Okay, no, no, it's all good. It's all good. I don't know okay, who no, you yeah. are. I you know, know you think you I'm Scuff Jim Carrey? No, SJC. I don't know. All I know is if it came down to it, I'll consider it. Okay. ABZ. Well, we're gonna have to pass. <laughs> we're gonna have to pass. Hey guys, you should congratulate Gary for making it to the front page. You read it today. It's, that was a big accomplishment. Right. Industry has been great lately. EBZ Gary's a good. Yeah, his dreams have been good. Thank you. EBZ, would you slap this man? Would you slap this man? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, dude. If he was talking shit, well, I, he he was he said he was talking shit. Hand. Ricky, he's literally Ricky. This guy he said in the so. chat he would fight you. Ricky, make a Twitter video. Ricky, tweet EBZ. Make a Twitter video and say you would fight EBZ. No, I'll give him the back. You would you would slap this man. <laughs> Ricky gets the backhand, man. Ricky, fuck that. He said he would beat your ass. Ricky, man, you get the backhand, man. What do you think your situation will save you with this shit talk you're doing? So you, what about like a handicapped person that's got like broken I fucking God, arms, broken it, legs, man. cancer, diabetes? If you were just a head, I will back, backhand you. <laughs> if you were just a head. If you were just a head, I will backhand you. Oh yeah, you guys should make music together. What the fuck? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, but you know, Gary, 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 would it be for free though? I mean, I'll charge my regular studio time, and then you know, if you want to beat or some shit. That is not for free. <laughs> well, I can't be for free. I gotta pay my bills. Because you gotta realize though, I already have a studio that I pay. Yeah, yeah. And it's already me and them were already conditioned. So you got his thing, bro. And we're conditioned. conditioned. Yeah, so but why, conditioned, the only way to why don't you just go to Gary, bro? Because he's conditioned to, with his money. Sex, what do you mean? The only way to uncondition me is to offer me something I'm not getting. Well, how about he's already in CX? It makes more sense. That doesn't. Why would you stay with your current guys? Being in CX doesn't mean you're musical. Gary would be a lot better than whoever you're with. It says why? Because Gary's fucking awesome. Well, I, you know, I appreciate you being awesome, but. Thank you. Being conditioned has nothing to do with being awesome. What condition are we talking about? Conditioned means okay. in tuned with. In 
tuned with you. With whoever it is you're working with. My, myself in particular, being that I'm, I'm going to be the one true. working with you. Okay. So, you know what I mean? It's like being in tune in such a way that, like, because I'm coming from a premise of all I'm trying to do is make the best product possible. True. Not true. to. How much be, is your studio not cost to be right, right now? Not to be right. EBC, okay. how much does your studio be, cost right now? Okay. Oh, man. He doesn't because he believes in my talent. He doesn't charge you. It's free. Free, yeah. Oh, well, then fuck me, dude. If he's free, well, you know, what are we talking about here? EBC, you know, no, what they, know. you know what they say. You get what you pay for. But I love my product. And I've gone to more expensive studios and gone back to my regular studio. I always do that. I mean, well, I yeah, have it's free. You just said everywhere. that. I have Paramount Studios. They're ready to go. I have studios, but... Paramount? Yeah. I mean, I have a friend who works at Paramount Studios, so he booked me $80 an hour. It'll be where all the JLo's and all that shit was. So why, would was actually, why wouldn't you want to go there? Record. I did a recording over there, but so, guess what? The sound was just like my basic studio. That's so how I realized I'm saving money. Yeah, but that's where you meet the connections and networking. The funny thing about it is, when you go to those studios, you're not meeting anyone. This is why your session. No one is coming in your anything. session. Yeah, but that's hey, when that's really when you letting you, you meet the session. producer of the in the studio, and the producer hooks you up with someone else. Understand something about the producer. When you walk up to the producer, he knows you're a no-name artist. Nine times out of ten, he's not bringing you into fucking Shaka Khan's or fucking Smoke Perp's studio session. And what because the who the fuck is Shaka Khan? It'll be kind of be, it'll kind of be disrespectful to them to bring just a random person in. So producers oh, are not bringing you into ten the minutes long sessions. You got to build your own name. And well, I mean, then, you got your guy for free. I understand. You know that makes sense. Can't argue with that. You know, Harvey actually has. His equipment to make music with him in the room. So let's break it out. He'll help you for free, I bet. Let me go ask him. It comes down to quality, guys. I don't care about free. I care about. I care about What's my up, quality. What's up, guys? How you doing? How's everybody doing? Shaka Khan, by the way. Shaka Khan, by the way. <laughs> I know, right? I went. I went. I went to Shaka from Shaka Khan to Smoke Perp. <laughs> that was tonight. Those two artists. <laughs> J Lo, Shaka Khan, and Smoke Perp. I was trying to go as wide as I could, man. As wide as I could. <laughs> Never mind, Harvey's doing, he up? Harvey's doing a sleep stream oh, in the room. He's literally sleeping on the bed with this streaming, dude. Already? I, I mean, it's early, I know. I don't know. what He's doing a sleep stream. I guess or he, his phone died, I think. He was doing a sleep stream because the selfie yeah, steps Gary, propped shit, up. Gary, but on some real shit, though. Yeah, yeah. Nine times out of, a lot of times when I've record, recorded with you, I had the impression, and I could be wrong, obviously. I'm just stating my... Why the fuck is this his thumbnail? I That's fucked. I had the fucked. impression that you were... You're, you were more focused on the mathematics behind the music, which is understandable. For Thank you, McLaren. I'm McLaren Knight. As in, this sounds good with this, or this is what it's supposed to be, or this is what it usually is. Okay. Versus what it feel, what feels good. And so it's like, and I understand that because Are I- Are you talking about like the session with him? All the sessions I've been, been in with you. Okay. And okay. keep in mind, the producer I work with, yes. the engineer I work with, he was exactly the same one when I met him. Mm -hmm. Every engineer I've met, Except some special ones, right? Mm -hmm. They understand that it doesn't matter what they've done before. It's about the vibe right now. Okay. You know, some yeah. people come in with the information of what they've done, they've done before, but they don't realize that what's going on right now is more important. Okay. So I'll give you an example. <clears throat> when I when I hear a new beat, I'm not thinking, oh my God, let's discuss what will sound good on it, right? I'm usually th I'm soaking it in, and a lot of times if a person starts telling me, oh man. Like, da, 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 da. It's like they're. I can't hear myself. I'm here. I'm listening to them. So they give you so advice. Do you don't want to hear so advice. So so you don't want the people to so help you improve, so bro. The, the session with. Al, Al, oh, let me get Andy in there. Andy Molinakis, right? <laughs> the session with Andy Molinakis. You guys were doing more talking than yeah, yeah. vibing, okay. which was cool, which prevented me from vibing though. Yeah, yeah. Like I literally had to wait for the session to be done. To have to be able to tap into myself. For sure. Which is understandable, but as an engineer, I would usually... Wait, hold on. EBZ, let's let's watch this then. last album with Harvey J's. He's legit. Ice. I still haven't been accepted into Reddit after donating hundreds. That's it. Oh, yeah. I can explain myself. Wait, wait, hold on. EBZ. Harvey J did make music with 21 Savage. So you should definitely do something with him. Uh, it would it make sense. Here, let's watch this though. Started. Ricky's gonna be talking some mad shit because that's what he said in the chat. Ricky, man, when I find you, I'm gonna throw you over a balcony. <laughs> EBZ, you might have fast hands, but I have a fast fucking scooter. 
Your legs will end up like mine. Cripple. He said he's gonna cripple you, EBZ. Man, I swear to God, when I find you, I am throwing you over the fucking rail. What you mean? <laughs> I swear to God. You're gonna fucking kill Ricky? <laughs> You're not gonna <laughs> slap him, bro. You're gonna kill him, dog. Throw you over the rail. Catch let me speak, you let me speak on the studio session. Throw you back over the rail. Run down and catch you on the knee. Number one, the, the, the <laughs> session with <laughs> Ice and Andy. Not it. Not. Oh, I didn't finish. The point I was making okay, was you guys did more you talking. Finish this. You not guys did yet. more talking yep. than Biden. Correct. Right, which, so which, no, okay, number one, for that stream in particular, it was more about the stream than the studio session. So if we come in and we do a studio session, it's going to be more about the session than the stream because that's what it would be for us. Do you know what I mean? So that case in particular, to me, it's more important that the stream was entertaining. So the vibing on the beat and stuff and things like that, Okay, I, I feel you, but like that wasn't the point of that that session. So that's not fair to judge me as an engineer based on that session. Okay, I like that. Also, I, basically, I what work, he's saying is he he he's he's saying that he's just, he's talking shit, dude. No, he's saying his his priorities were different. In that particular session, okay, but since in the last year alone, I've worked with probably two to three hundred artists in the studio, and I adapt to them. So I know what you're saying, and certain artists want me to be a certain way and shit like that. So I know hundred percent. I respect that. Too. What you're saying. Um, so yeah, that's it, dude. I wouldn't judge it off that. It's, it's just, well, you know, we're fucking around the studio trying to have a good time. When I have my clients and they're paying me for my time, it's a different thing. And I adapt to them and I do exactly what they need me oh, to do. Oh yeah, we need to uh, finish that song one day. I know, dude. Are we going to finish it or what? Yeah. I, I'll schedule sometime this week, bro. Let's do it, bro. And we'll finish it. Ricky. Is that fair? On Discord, bro. Yeah. Yeah, I'll definitely. We'll put him in my fucking virgin lair then. And then, you know, one thing about me, man. I, I know that talk is cheap. When the time comes, we'll see how it plays out. I know that you know. Every time I show up, I'm trying to make. What are your current stu- What are your current? No, I understand. Whatever it takes. But to the, make best the best product, product in that possible. moment was the streaming. And no, no, no. And that's why I respected yeah, yeah. what you said because at the end of the day, if the stream was more important to you at that moment, there's no way you would have focused on the music because you were focused on the music. Like the fact you had like the, and the, you said the little so. argument you just said and everything, so. not argument, but you know, with Andy and like us, we were kind of bantering, having fun. But to me, that's good because it was entertaining for the no, stream. No, no, that's what I'm saying. You yeah. just you just verbalized it. Look, my priority was not the music; it was the stream. So yeah. of course, it makes sense why I'm looking at you and saying you're doing more talking. Than vibing, so yeah, yeah. My, if my clients come in, I don't tell them e- how to fucking do it. EBZ, their song. what are your current studio producer? What does he What does he tell you? Nothing. I tell him. That's the problem. No, it's not. You should want feedback from the engineer as well. Though. Well, he gives me feedback. Listen, and that's why I say conditioned, because when you're conditioned with someone, you know when to listen, you know when to feedback. You know what I mean? Like yeah. because you know what's passionate versus what's questionable. There are times when I'm talking to him and I'm like, I'm not, you know, I'm just thinking it. Like, I'm not sure. And there are times when I'm like, this is what you do, dude. You know, shit like that. <laughs> In- interesting, bro. That's funny. All right, fucking. But that would be cool, man. So the next session we do with TSA, you know, let's see how that goes. Yeah, yeah. And if it's cool, I mean, shit, man. Like, my, my guy is, <clears throat> he's awesome. But at the end of the day, it's always good to have other ones you know different a fresh yeah. mentality Ricky I really you want know. you to go on discord I really I really do I mean, just talk shit to EBZ that'd be so funny cause EBZ can't handle it he's not ready for it and also I see them send you clips out of context and shit you 100% out of context dude they sent him a clip of me saying to the stream I said I said out of context I go I go I'm a fucking asshole I'll kill you and I was joking saying I wanted to be a serial killer in a movie and they clipped it and they put Gary talking about EBZ and then they yeah. sent it to him and he watches yeah. it and like this fucking roach and shit and I'm like yo that's not even what I said hey they're smart actually they, <laughs> I'm like yo this dude's gonna wanna fight me now they're at, that's, the actually, that's actually that's actually smart thanks for giving me the idea it was funny you were setting him it was up. funny though Roaches. <laughs> Out of context, uh, yeah, for sure. Oh, it was all you, homie. That's good. Um, yeah, you should give him free studio sessions. He's fucking EBZ. What? He's f- oh. He's EBZ, bro. Give him. Okay, no, but honestly, but honestly, honestly, no, honestly, when Harvey, no, honestly. EBZ, you should go wait when on I Harvey. Go to the studio, I, and you I should the get a studio hours. equipment. I charge you what the studio charged me, and I didn't take a profit. So I, I did give you for free for sure. So I, I agree. But I'm not gonna pay for the studio time and lose money. Why? What do you mean? You pay for it. 
No. Well, what the fuck? What do I get out of it? What do I get out of it? You get to produce fucking EDZ song. No, but I can't. I'm not gonna. Why would I come out of the pocket and not charging for my engineering? Because services? his song's gonna blow the fuck up, and then you're gonna get you know attention from that. That's not how Gary, it works. Gary, let's be honest here. That's not how it works. You're the engineer, right? Yo. Yes. You no, oh, hey, Ricky, what's up? I'm not aware. What the fuck is doing? Wait, hold on. Yo, guys. Yo, guys. Yo, studio shows is great. Fantastic. Yo, EBZ. Ricky's got a bone to pick with you. He'd be talking mad shit. Why are you hitting on cripple people? Ricky, listen. Why do you want to slap cripple people? If you were cripple, since you are cripple, what you Who should be doing is staying in obs- that obscurity. You, you should fucking down syndrome kids. As much as well as possible. You don't want to come into the limelight. You see, the limelight is a fast lane. Things happen at a blink of an eye. Listen, listen, you might have, protect yourself you might have when things are going at a blink of an eye. You might get But you talking swipes. about a fucking cripple that can beat your fucking ass you might the fucking end up in, rap. I'm telling listen, listen. If I was crippled, I'd be watching The Sopranos right now. Happy that Tony Soprano just wrings someone's neck. But to be on live stream talking my own version of shit, that would not be very fair to what can happen when I feel like Tony Soprano. You see... Tony Soprano has two arms, two legs, and he's a mobster. Mm-hmm. Don't be coming on stream sounding this like This ain't a movie, though. This is real life. Why are you quoting a movie? Oh my God. What are you talking about? My ABC? God. This is Sopranos? Told, he told me to quote real life. Okay, real life. Where are your legs at? <laughs> real life. Wow. Where are my where, legs at? Where are your legs at? Me? Let's You're be real. me. Because my, my I just can't right walk. here, I could, I could I run up on you. Is that a problem? I, I can't walk. you. Where are your legs at? What are you gonna willy throw towards me? Man, I'll <laughs> kick you over the damn rail, man. Top this shit. Man. How about I will catch you willing towards me and Dude, walk you your ass me. into the middle? How about I'll catch you willing towards me and walk your ass into the middle of traffic and just leave you there? Dude, he's getting into it. <laughs> Ricky, you're gonna let him do that to you? You're gonna let him have you get hit by I'll cars? Just, I wouldn't even hit you. I'll just grab your thing. Walk your ass slowly through the middle of traffic. Maybe mm-hmm. you bitch slap you mm-hmm. so you're disoriented when a car hits you. Mm-hmm. And just you, you leave you there. You can, you and then stream it. You you grab his dick. And then stream it to see what happens. You can grab my dick, bro? You get? He said grab dick. <laughs> Do you have a dick? Let me yeah, ask bro. you something. From where are you paralyzed? Is it the chest down, navel down, pubic hair down, or is it the tongue down? <laughs> You don't even know, dude. You don't even know. I'm not paralyzed. Okay, what are you? You're just sitting in the chair? He's a human. What do you mean? What is he? Because <laughs> you look off. weird. You look awkward to me. I just wonder. <laughs> I mean, what's the truth, bro? Listen, if I were in your shoes, or at least in your presumed shoe, you, you I wouldn't be on the live stream. That's a weak point. You talk too much. I do? Yeah. Okay, where are you presently? Canada. What did he say? Canada. Canada. He said Englewood. You're in Canada. Yeah. So this bro. is an echo. Is that what I'm hearing? An echo. You mean an igloo? Okay. This dude. This guy is echoing from a mile away. I'm echoing. How Am are I? You, how are you expected to come through? Through this echo? I mean, it's a sound wave. I'm over here in the flesh. Two legs. Talking mad shit. You're echoing from Canada. Well, I, I just plan to come to Canada soon so we can hop on his dick and we'll work from there. <laughs> I like that. Good comeback. He said you can hop on his dick and work your way from there. What do you mean echo? What does that even mean, dude? Ice, you speak English. Yeah, I speak English. What the fuck do you mean by echo? Well, we don't yeah, speak ghetto, bro. bro. We don't speak ghetto. He's so far away. <laughs> he said you don't, he don't speak ghetto. Okay, I'm not sure what you're referring to. Because the last time I checked, I asked you where the fuck you were. <laughs> I mean, if that was ghetto, then, you know, enlighten me. I'm missing that book. And then they're like, you're echoing. You're echoing. What does it even mean? What does that mean? Well, Google it, bro. I'm sorry. I'm not a teacher. I didn't come here to fucking give lessons. What the fuck is wrong with What's you? What's going to come up? It's like... You came to talk <laughs> shit. Now talk your <laughs> shit. Don't ask questions, bitch. Every time I open my mouth, you interrupt. You open your mouth? Every time you open your mouth. Every time you open your mouth. <laughs> He's like, are you drunk, bro? Like, what nah, are you drinking, bro? Because I drank Hennessy, but I have a feeling you took more shots than me. 
Uh, you're, you're hilarious. You shouldn't be drinking in your state, bro. You, your body can only contain a finger worth of fucking Hennessy. I know what my body can contain, and it can't contain on, your bro. punches. You're, you're, you're nothing but a head. The weak. The weak. You're a head on a fucking tripod. Get the fuck out of here trying to talk to me, bro. Get, be careful. Is the wind blowing where you're at? Bro, sure I can't wait. Make sure your wheels you. are fucking wait. bolted. Yeah. Make sure. Okay. What's that thing that you put on a bicycle? The damn thing that you Training put. Training wheels. No, the thing that you put down so the bicycle stands still. Oh, kickstand. The kickstand. Make sure your kickstand is propped <laughs> up, bro. Yeah. <laughs> you're going to need some standing strict. Hold on, EBZ. EBZ, let him talk. Yeah. Let's, let, Ricky, what do you have to say about EBZ? You notice they made me stop to let well, you. Well, first, first, first I'm going to run him over, right? He's going to go to the ground. Then I'm going to get off my scooter, crawl over to him, because that's what I do. I don't walk. I crawl. I'm going to sit on his fucking face and beat his dick. Wow. You mean in all this pressure that life has given you, you mm -hmm. have another personal pressure, which is that of being gay. Oh my God, that's fucked up. So not only can you get no pussy, well, you're, but you're you gay. can't. So, so I'm you can't even go to a, You can't even go to a gay bar and get mm -hmm. dick because mm -hmm. gay bars are exclusive. Like you don't even find you know gay bars. How do you, you know that? You gotta go past like 20, 30 how do you, bars how, to how get do you know to my one life, gay bro? bar. How do you know my life? How do you know my life? How do I know your life? I just know what gay bars are like, you know, and I know they're like one every 30. So how do you find gay bars? That's a lot of crawling, bro. That's crazy. And then when you get to the gay bar, mm -hmm. how do you, how do you, how do we, get, how do, how do we uh, get to gay bars when it's really, we're talking about your dick right now? Oh my God. This we're talking about your dick. We're talking, about your dick. we're talking about your dick, dude. You want to talk about my dick? I'm not, I'm, yeah, I'm going to talk about that dick. How are you gonna talk about my dick, bro? How, how big is that dick? Is gonna... How big is that dick, bro? My dick yeah. slap the shit out of you, out of you. I mean, listen, man. I can use my dick to knock have you seen, out all balance. Have you seen my teeth? Have you seen my teeth, bro? Feed this teeth. I could, ch I could chew that shit apart. He could chew you apart. Your dick. Your dick. Yeah. Listen, I understand yeah. what a gremlin looks like. Yeah. Okay? You don't have to describe it. Have you ever been attacked by one? When I knew you were all head, I knew it was gremlin related. Don't mm -hmm. worry about the teeth. I get it. It's some ugly shit. <laughs> That's basic. <laughs> go, yeah, so you scared. Explain so what you tell me, you're scared. you're scared. I know a few motherfuckers that you can relate to, but I won't talk about them right now because out of respect. Yeah. Personally, though, I like you, dude. But I do want to fight real? you. Because I thought it was a joke. I, I, I do want to fight you. No, he's real. What do you mean? I'm, I was just joking. I didn't know you were. Are you real? What? What do you mean? Is he real? Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say all those things to you, man. What? No, 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 no. Who it is? You can't back Please. down. You can't Wait, back down. On. I didn't mean to say all those things to you. Wait, he's just right there. I thought it was a photo intense intense argument. Picture. Okay. He sent uh, a video. Hey, bro, check it out, bro. Hey, listen, bro. Hey, listen. We it's cool. Not hey, nah, bro. Dude, hey, nah, partner. Nah, 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 nah. Hey, partner, from the bottom of my heart, man. I don't mean that shit, man. I'm just talking shit, man. Listen. Do you, you thought we were fucking you, around? You could dog me all you want. I'm good. God has blessed me good enough. I'm good. If you want to dog me, I'm fine. That's fine. Hey, you're right. You're right. I ain't shit. <laughs> the good Lord would tell you the rest. Did you really not know that was Sam? <laughs> what did you, you literally called him a head with a tripod, like a head on a tripod stick. Yeah. That's what you called him. No, I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't mean that shit, bro. Come on, man. Listen, man. There must be some truths to that, though. Like, nah. you obviously knew what was I going was on. Photoshop Since you said image. that, you're not, play, you can't play it dumb nah, now. Nah, I thought it was a Photoshop image. Come Dude, on, you're bro. Going, you're going, Photoshop listen, image, you're going to hell. Be, listen. How that could that be that many Photoshop images? images? You're, you're going to hell. You knew exactly what you were doing. Let me explain something, something to you guys. You you guys. That could have been me. I didn't choose to be in this body. What? I just happened to be in this body. So I'm not gonna circum I'm not gonna look down on the next person who did not choose to be in that body. So I apologize, bro. I didn't mean that shit. I'm just talking shit on camera, man. Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, uh, he left. So uh, I mean, I'm sure y'all will make great friends after he beats that ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing here, Keenan? Hey, come here. What's well, up, Keenan? Uh, I heard what you said last night, Paul. I don't even remember what I said, Keenan. Uh, you called me a little bitch, and you said Lataris is uh, better than me. <laughs> no, I called Lataris a bitch, too.
Finally. You did that too, yes. Um, so, I'm here to quit. No. Yeah. You're here to quit? I'm going to quit, and then SSJ said if I sucked his dick, I could live in the Hummer for free. <laughs> so. What? <laughs> no, I'm not quitting. I'm just fucking. These gay jokes again, Rev. Why don't you guys have some bitches jokes? You're not quitting. God damn Let's it. Let's talk about bitches. Let's God talk about the R. Kelly it, scandal. Fuck, you're not Thanks. actually quitting. God. Thanks, God. What do you think about the R. Kelly scandal? Well, hold on. Fuck R. Kelly. Hold on. What? What? Uh, <laughs> what? What did you Kelly. think about last night? I was just, I was drunk, dude. It was pretty funny, honestly. But Man, you still, you is... do want to fuck Brie and Katie, though. No, dude, I managed them. I'm not going to have sex with them. I don't know why I said you, she gave you blowjobs. She didn't. Once you I want the blowjob. Once I work with someone, it's off limits. 100%. That's bullshit. It's 100% true, bro. Dude, when you get girls to your There's... house, you literally say you have all this clout. Oh, I don't you work use with them. clout to fuck girls. I don't work girls. with them. I don't work with them ever. Yeah, it's the same thing, though. I might say it, but I don't ever work with but them. But he's joking. The R. Kelly shit is real. What? What, what are you talking shit? about? Like, me, did shit. you hear about the R. Kelly shit? What R. Ke what? He pees on people? What? Let me ask you a question. I saw it on the Boondocks if, episode. If what? You, if you got sued five years ago or ten years ago for peeing on a little girl and you went to court and you were acquitted and then ten years later, Lifetime releases a documentary about you, how would you feel? Do you think that's right for Lifetime to release a documentary about you? About him peeing on people? Ten years after you were acquitted for it? Isn't well, that, what do you think, I mean, how do What you does know? acquitted mean, like not guilty? Yeah. So if you go to court for that, 14 counts. You didn't settle out of court. You went to court. You won. And then 10 years later, at some TV special, decides to release a video saying, bringing all these girls together like some kind of kumbaya and saying, yeah, this person. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, I would just sue the TV show and get free money. What are you saying? That's what I said. Were the girls underage? That, well, at the time, it seemed like they kind of were. Guilty. Guilty. Why do you care about R. Kelly? Are you an R. Kelly fan? Well, I'm. 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 I'm talking. Imagine about being an R. Kelly no, fan. No, no, no. This is. This is the threat to justice is one, threatens justice to all. R. Kelly literally pees on people, dude. Well, listen. Being a sexual deviant is exactly what he's guilty of. Okay, that's not right. You can't just go around peeing on motherfuckers. Sexual deviant, guilty. You know, but this shit that these girls are getting together and. Writing books and coming up with... So you're saying that special. girls who get peed on and raped are, I'm saying, shouldn't I'm have saying, a voice. Is that I'm what you're saying, saying EBZ? Saying Not only do you hate cripples, but you don't want rape <laughs> victims to have a voice I'm either. What else, EBZ? I'm saying thoughts are not supposed to be allowed to win. But thoughts seem to be winning nowadays, man. They the were raped, doing? bro. What do you mean? Man, the bitch was not raped. That's she was why I wanted to meme a little bit. Dick. <laughs> she was giving Dude, blow what jobs. are you saying? Wait, didn't get any did you just come here to say that? And show, but like, okay. so she's, it, yeah. she figured something out. Dude, you can't say that, EVC. What do you mean? It's true, though. It's fucking twats. Bro, we're, we're, blow jobs. I don't know R. Kelly's situation, but weren't they underage? I already know that if you, if a guy invites me to his house or a girl invites me to their what? house. What? A guy? I'm just saying, right? Because the girls didn't want to sleep with R. Kelly. That's what it seems like. But didn't he have them like locked locked in his house and he they couldn't call like their families and no. shit? Yeah, he like locked these Same girls in his him? house. No, he peed on behind. them. He, he raped them. them. They those were like girls, fourteen. It's like bro. mentally though. They fuck. He he like mentally. Have you ever tried to holler at a fourteen year old girl? What? Not since I was fourteen. <laughs> oh, oh well. Have you ever seen somebody talking to a girl who thought he was older? Like what? someone being inappropriate with a young. Let girl? me just rephrase it to you. When I was a kid and I saw adults, I wanted nothing to do with them. Okay. As a kid, yeah. when I saw adults, when I went to a party and I saw grown people, I wanted nothing to do with them. <laughs> okay, but but if these girls did, then so he shouldn't be taking advantage of them. Well, he shouldn't. He shouldn't. <laughs> so if that's what he did, then that's what we're talking about. Yeah. But if you listen to the story, the girls are mad at the fact that he didn't treat them right. Right? Not all of them were underage. There were a few of them that were underage. We're That's so those were underage. Ones, those ones. Guilty. Those ones. Why are you sticking about. up for him, EBC? I'm just saying, listen, let's call it. What are you doing? You like good songs, I know. Let's talk about. No, no, I don't give a fuck about R. Kelly's songs. I don't give two fucks about his songs. Well, why are you sticking up for I a guy listen to those who things. rapes and I mean, like underage women? I don't mean, listen to that shit, man. I don't listen to. Man, no, you I have not. never played an R. Kelly song in the past five years. I'm a hero, years. hero? That's a fucking... In the past five years, I have not typed in. Well, I'm guilty of that. I have typed in R. Kelly a couple times. This five five now I'm not trying to be real. There you go. But hey, pretty girl, I'm feeling you. The way you, you do the things you do. I reminds me of my left is cool. Dumb. That's why I'm more than real. Bro, you, you can't dump an underage girl. 
Underage girls. Why is he fucking with underage, underage girls, girls in the first place? First and then all, he pees on them. First of all, underage girls should not be at an adult's house. No shit. He okay, probably then. kidnapped that's, them or something. <laughs> that's where the conversation started. He didn't kidnap them. What do you do? He probably yeah, lured yeah. them in with his clout, and then he peed on them and, okay, so and kidnapped I them. Can't work. Shit. Listen, I can't even work. Listen, man, listen. That's some celebrity shit. That's a celebrity problem. You have to be a celebrity to get into problems like that. Are you mad that they dug it up years later? There's a Reddit post. That's what I'm talking about. Hold on. That's what I'm talking about. That I get. There's a Reddit post. His own daughter says he's a monster. His own daughter? His own daughter says he's a monster. Oh shit, let's read that. What did she say? I don't know. It just says uh, his daughter calls him a monster. Read it. Read it out. What did she say? Uh, She's saying, motherfucking, I don't know, long ass article, dude. She says... Unfortunately, for my own reasoning, my family has endured, blah, 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 blah. He peed on women, blah, blah, blah. She was 14, blah, blah, blah. What the fuck, EBZ? That's what you she know said. What the fuck you're talking about? She didn't say that. <laughs> she didn't say that. She did not say that. Dude, you're crazy, dude. I just don't like seeing thoughts winning. I mean, look at these bitches. They've got book deals, empty. If I was raped, or if my daughter was raped... But anybody I knew was what raped. What the hell? We will People be talking, are searching this shit. We will shit. be on CNN, Footage. like Master P said. We will be at the police department. But if a TV camera came and said, tell us a story. Like, I don't know this is somebody who's really personal. inspirational. We're talking rape right here. What the fuck do you think I want to be on some goddamn special? But well, maybe they have to go and be on a special because he's already like a celebrity person. person. So it's their it's way to get their message out there. So yeah, that the way your goddamn you know message. It. You're trying to get an acquittal. Get your message out there. They're trying to get a book deal. He's a little creepy. I mean, but does it matter, though? EBZ, do you find it acceptable to pee on just underage think, girls? I, just, I don't th- find it acceptable. I just know that only rich people would have these problems. Because what? the average guy out down the street will not find himself being flocked upon by what? a bunch of 14-year-old girls who say they want to hop on his dick. And they're waiting in rooms for him to fucking finish with one to the next. That Bro, happens I don't think they were expecting. I don't something. think these fourteen-year-old girls were something. waiting for him. Yes, dude. they were. If you listen to the documentary, they're not mentally uh, mature fuck enough that. to make that fuck decision. That. Why would R. Kelly? That. Why would that. what? Fuck why that. would R. Kelly want to go with a fourteen-year-old? He's a grown man. He should yes, know better. That's, that's the problem. I understand that. But a, a room, rooms full of girls waiting on this grown man to fuck each and every one of them. That's a different conversation we're having over here. Like, he didn't lock the door. You're not chained to the bed. That's what happens when you're raped. Dude, they're you're mentally, they're 14. What mental? The you, money, because all the Lamborghini. No, because when you're young, when you're, only, when you're 14, you yeah. can't make that type of decision you're, on you're your own. You're impressionable. Yeah. So the Lambo was impressionable. The Maserati and the Mansion. But you're not an adult. Your brain is even fully fucking developed. That's fucking fucking bikini waiting for him to nah. come and fuck you until he's done. So if you had yeah. a daughter and she was 14, you'd if be like, she's old enough to make her own shitty decisions? R. Kelly's house and I walked into my daughter, I'd be like, block out, bitch, the fuck are you doing exactly. in R. Kelly's house? Exactly, so they house? don't have a father to do that. Get your ass over here. Get, <laughs> and if she tells me, I want to do the Lifetime Special, I'd be like, bitch, you are not going to go into the motherfucking Lifetime Special, okay? You went with the wrong thing. We're not going to publicize your nonsense. <laughs> fuck is wrong with these bitches? Wait, what, what is We're this? not publicizing your stupid activity. What is this clip, dude? EBZ says he wants to kiss Elixir's 16-year-old sister. I didn't say that. What the <laughs> fuck is going on? Not a context. I did not say that. <laughs> wow. I would have arrived at that on that day. I feel like I feel successful. EBZ's logic is so flawed. 79 IQ. You know, Roger. Me and Elixir's sister in the tree, in the tree kissing. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> I would have arrived at that on is, is it, is it, wait, is his sister actually 16? No, she, she was not. at Elixicon, I think. No, she's not. EBZ, do you know that? No, she's not 16. It's a grown ass woman. Look at that ass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. No wonder why he's a Ben and R. Kelly. I'm joking, I'm joking. Well, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> wait, what? No, I really hope she's uh-huh. not 16 after hearing uh-huh. that. She's not 16. That ass was not 16, though. Bro, you, you, that you, was a grown. I suggest guy. that you don't go. You don't even go there, dude. Because <laughs> someone's gonna I'm clip joking. that and they're no, gonna I'm call joking, you I'm joking, I'm joking, something I'm else, dude. I'm joking. I know they would. I'm just, oh my! What the hell, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Paul.
I'm so... You've said worse. You've said worse things on stream. Fuck out of here. What not about the hell? not about underage kids. Nah, come on. Bro. At some point, you've got had to have. You've said some. Crazy I've shit never before. said anything about underage well, kids. Well, that's because we haven't looked at all. You clips. gotta find the clip. What you do you? No, because it's I'm not there. stupid, clip, and I'm not gonna it's talk about this clip. on fucking stream or ever. But you know. Like, what do you mean? There was only one situation. There was this girl. Her name was India. She was 17. She told me she was 18. And I was like, okay. You got a from her? No. No, no, no. <laughs> she was living far away. Why is she telling you and I went And I, I went in Discord and I talked to her. And I was like, yeah, you're cute. And then she was, you know. You were giving compliments and then, and then to an eight, a 17-year-old girl. She told me she was 18. I even talked to her fucking parents, dude. And I saw her a fake ID. That's and exactly what happened to R. Kelly. That's, he talks no. to these girls' parents. <laughs> no. The parents drop them off, drop the girls off. No. He finishes what he's doing. Then they sue him. Homie, I was not having no girl have her parents drop. I was literally just, I saw a fake ID, right? She said she was 18. I was like, I asked for the ID because I didn't believe him. I'm like, all right, you're 18. And then she got doxxed. And the doc says she was 17. And I'm like, fuck, that's not true. Or I'm like, fuck, is this true? And then, because I already said you're good looking at shit in Discord. And she's like, no, talk to my parents. Though. I talked to her parents. The girl in And then her parents, her parents back her up. But yeah. then we, do then they, they, they doxxed her again. The and then they fucking, I was like, well, this is bullshit. I'm not talking the to you The girl anymore. in Florida was Before 17, Terry though. Talk to him about no. The one who showed up YouTube. as you fucked. Remember the one what? Your boyfriend walked in, slapped you in the room? Excuse me? Yeah, remember the stream was like she's seventeen and she had to like trust. No, like the stream was help. trolling, dude. What are you saying? Well, who are we gonna believe? The stream. Not the I stream. I believe you this time. <laughs> Not the this stream, one. dude. What? I believe you the first yeah. time. Yeah, dude. Yeah. She couldn't have been seventeen. She, she had, had a fake ID on her too. No, she had like injected birth control, dude, and she was like twenty or something, bro. That's what sounds better, of course. What do you mean? Mm-hmm. You're mm -hmm. what the fuck are you saying, dude? Exposed. And where did you get yeah. this? Where did you get this information from? Then I you was see? there. And, and, was and what? There. You read the chat, and the chat no, was like, "She's chat. 17." I remember the chat was like, "No, she's 17." Then she was like, "No, no." She pulled out her little fake ass ID, and we all said, "Whatever, fuck your ID." And then, she, then you guys disappeared to the room. And before I know it, I heard a door knock. Red hair opened the door. Ginger opens the door. Ginger is like, "Everything is cool." Before I know it, I hear swack. You guys are arguing. The 17 year old gets up putting her panties on. I was there to make sure she didn't get into any trouble. What do you want? What? To say? How does that prove she's 17, dude? You just made no sense at all right there. What are you saying? That's what R. Kelly says. No, you literally. I'm like, why? I'm like, how do you say she's 17? Where is this information coming from? You gave me no. The chat said she was 17. You think the chat? Boxer. The chat is trolling, dude. The chat says every girl is 17. E B Z. So the last girl who you said they doxxed, who was that again? You just said they doxxed. Her name was you. India, and she was actually doxxed. They weren't just saying it in the chat. She was fully doxxed. Dox means divorce address, right? Yes, divorce and that's when I stopped talking to her because she was lying to me. Same thing. With I talked girl. to her for like a the week or something on with, Discord. This other girl, the one you screwed in And that's why I she don't ever talk well. to girls on Discord ever since then because fuck girls on Discord, honestly. Dude, don't try to, don't put that shit on me. What are you saying, dude? Talking about I like, fucked a 17 year old? What are you saying, bro? I'm not the one over here sympathizing for a fucking rapist, dog. I, I'm not sticking up for a rapist. You literally stuck up for a I'm rapist. I'm sticking up for thoughts winning. Like, the fuck are you doing? You came to this guy. You can't be a thought when you're came 14, to this dude. guy trying to make money off of this guy. Things didn't work out, so you figure out the next best thing was to join the fucking cast of those who are suing him. For a dollar. Mm. That's some basic ass shit. It happens all the mm. fucking time. Who else is exposing people? It's only fucking thoughts exposing their men. The real women I know never want to talk. I don't want to talk about relationships I've had. If I had a relationship with a girl and you asked me about it, I'd be like, it's none of your fucking business. Good or bad. That was something we shared that was special. We're done with it. We're done with that. Kind of like Aaliyah. When they asked her about... Oh, but it was something but it was something you shared that was special, right? Is it special, special when it's a grown man and a 14-year-old girl? No. Then it, then it should be shared. Listen, that's, pedo that's pedophilia. Well, that's what he did. I'm not supporting that. But then didn't you say that's what was in the house? If that's this, if that's what was in the house, yeah. then of course that needs to be exposed. Okay. Obviously. But I'm saying... I'm really sorry to think you did have sex with Jasmine. Some of those bitches in the house, are in the interviews, they were with him when he was fucking a 14-year-old. So how the fuck... So he did fuck 14-year-olds. Listen, yeah, he did. What, so are we, what are we talking that's, that's, about? Listen, listen though, listen though. But the who's giving the interview? So I'm with 
you're with a girl who and you, you guys fuck a 14 year old. Okay. She's giving the interview and she's exempt. She should be on trial. The 14 year old? No, the woman who was with you when you were fucking the 14 year old. Why is she not on trial? I guess because mm-hmm. she has no money to offer. You know? I mean. Fuck that bullshit, man. If you want to blame R. Kelly, you got to blame all these bitches. What the fuck are you doing laying? I'm sorry. You're, what are you doing laying in the man's house when you, he's... But why are you riding so hard for R. Kelly? You're I'm blaming a 14-year-old for having no, sex I, with I R. Kelly. Wrong. Like the Me Too it's shit. It's wrong. You pinpoint the guy who seems to be on and try to bring him down as much as you Even can. Forgetting these Kelly thugs that are lingering idiot. around him. I <laughs> that bullshit. his wife and underage girls. Idiot. Fuck that. These thoughts are winning. They come, out, come around you... Hope, expect you to be Please this great this guy. Or Kelly's lawyer guy. over here. They go see a motherfucking attorney and say, you know what? He's whispering nasty things in my ear. That's why I have a case. Me too. Bitch. Now I know That's why the first time you whispered nasty things in my ear. Like that was the whole concept of you were You were his. Oh. <laughs> you fuck up as much as him, though. People are going to take advantage of you. I still even kissed Kiss in the bathroom one day at one point. And I think I think I'm going to be able to Also, yeah. Is this Chappelle? Yeah. Dave Chappelle literally made... He didn't get acquitted from court. That Dave Chappelle literally made a, a, a skit of him pissing on people. If he was acquitted, he would be sued for slander, so it must be true. What do you say now? Dave Chappelle what? Dave Chappelle made a skit about R. Kelly pissing on people. So it must be true, no, otherwise it's, it's slander. It's not slander. Let me tell you parody. something about pissing on people. I was saying this, this the other day on chat. My nephew, who's three years old, if you try to piss on this kid, he doesn't know anything. <laughs> what? But if you try to piss on this kid, he would literally frown at you, dodge, and probably smack you. Because he's appalled from the idea that you're giving him your fucking excrement. He's three years old, of course. So how the fuck does a 14-year-old girl... Because she doesn't have a good family around her. this bitch, for example, is that P? Yeah. What is she doing? Is that dancing in a music video? That's P, yeah. Wow. (laughs) (laughs) Impressive. ABZ, you realize when you're 14, you're very influenced by the older people around you. I realize you. that, listen, some people get swayed. I understand that sometimes... Especially when I they're probably drunk. It's not clear, though. Probably yeah, held so down. I understand that people get swayed. He has clout, even, even so they're scared. Fall. Even you, Gary. You could be in the right situation. Even me. I could be in the right situation and get swayed. But it's on us because we're adults. No, no, no. Not necessarily. We, we Let have... me explain something to you. Let me just say something else. This is beyond what I just said. Sometimes you know the right thing, but you're in the wrong environment, and they would encourage you and sway you to do what you know is wrong. That happens all the time. For that, of course, I'm, I blame the people who know better, the people who are swaying. Because at the end of the day, if R. Kelly did what he So blame R. Kelly. If R. Kelly is doing what he I know, I blame him. Right? Have a room full of chicks and you're fucking each, other, each one of them in, 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 in a row? Eventually, shit is going to go bad. She's like, shit in, shit out. Like, you're turning this shit into a brothel. What are, you, what are you expecting? Even if they're all compliant to the fuck. It's just a matter of time before one of them but says... They're complying, though. They it's can't just comply, a matter though. Of fun. It's just 14. a matter of time. Even if they're all compliant, it's just a matter of time before they say, fuck this. And whoever starts saying, fuck this, believe me, it's going to spread like wildfire. When you're treating a group of people but bad... But if he wasn't doing anything illegal, treat- then it would have been fine. No! When you're been treating fine. a group of people bad, legal or illegal, it's just a matter of time before they backfire. Is that true? Yeah, but if you give them ammunition, like underage sex shit, they're gonna go fucking. Then, then, it's, then you fucked up. So he. But fucked you hear up. what I'm saying? No, I'm saying. Treating people bad, good or good or bad, legal or illegal. If you're making me feel bad and you're mm-hmm. doing legal things to me, it's just a matter of time before I find a way to get you back. Maybe, well, potentially. If you did it to a group of us, it's just a matter of time before we did it. EBZ. Yeah. I just, that. I just looked it up. What's that? R. Kelly's. R. Kelly secretly married a 15-year-old girl named Aaliyah. Yeah, Aaliyah. Dude, he married Aaliyah, the that's singer, the news. famous singer. That's not news. The he one married, that died in the plane crash. What do you think about him marrying this girl at 15 years old? Let me tell you guys something, man. First of all, you've only lived in the United States. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay. There are other mentalities I around the world. Tell him to so what you find as an abomination 
it's not necessarily an abomination to the next. Which person. abomination are you, are you talking about specifically? Uh, so in something. Cameroon, let me finish what I'm saying. Can you just? I started speaking. Let me finish. At 15. Not everybody, even in the states, there are a lot of women in this country who married at 15. R. Kelly's not special. Okay. He's yes, a leader. There are a lot of women he's in, the in public this eye. world. Okay then. He's in the public so eye. He is special. But don't make it seem as though he's a, a fucking unique circumstance. These circumstances are all around us. Um, no, you it, have your uncle who's They should all be listen, fucking in your, jail. Pro, your dad probably married, married your mom when she was 18. <laughs> Look deep into your Not fucking 14? Self. No. Your dad probably hey, married, married your mom or started courting your mom when she was 16. Because he was 16. Not necessarily. Yeah, yeah. My mom got married at 23. I'm, I'm, I'm taking a stand that there are a lot of relationships in the U.S. Where the parents who are responsible today, maybe lawyer and doctor, maybe whatever, whatever the fuck they are, they are responsible adults. But when they met, mom was 16, <laughs> dad was probably 23, 24. They never tell anybody about it because they ended up getting married, they ended up having... I'm not condoning it. But can I point out I'm the fact saying, that you listen, keep giving different ages than what they are? EBZ, you do know that... I'm not condoning The, the people that marry 15-year-olds are probably hillbilly fucking rednecks that do incest. R. Kelly, being a famous person, should not marry a 15-year-old because yeah, it's illegal. I don't, not, your mentality doesn't it. matter I'm when it's bad. illegal. I wouldn't marry a 14-year-old. You would. I would not. Be <laughs> yeah. I would hope not. But that goes against your argument because your mentality in Cameroon, maybe they no, do that. My mentality around the world is that I don't interact with people who are not on my level to an extent. I can only do so much. On my that. level to an extent. Yeah, what does that even has mean? Everybody different page they're on. You think about this, he thinks about that, I think about these. They're just different mentalities. Yeah. I'm thinking one, you're thinking two. This is a nice healthy argument. How the fuck are we going to interact? Yeah. If you're 14 and I'm talking this kind of shit, listen, when I'm fucking, I'm trying to fuck deep. You sitting over here, sitting over talking about I'm scared. We're not, we don't need to be in the same damn bed. We're sitting over here, you sitting there talking about you trying to figure this out. Oh, what is, oh, I never fuck out of my bed then. If you're sitting over talking about I'm drunk, I don't understand fuck out of my bed then. Like, you need to be coming in this room talking about this is how I get down. <laughs> and if you get down like that, and of, obviously you're right, like, you need to be. What are you saying? What I'm the just fuck saying, are you I need saying? to fuck with people who are on my level. And 14 year old girls are not on the, an adult level. Then why exactly. You, then why are you defending R. Kelly? I just said, I I'm not defending a person who is being a pedophile. But I do understand that to be a pedophile to about 40 fucking women. There is something that's making this possible. Is it your clout? Oh, funny. Roaches are attracted to dirt. Or more like flies to shit. So you're making bitches, excuses for bitch, I'm not making excuses to them. I'm just saying if you're a thought, you would find yourself in these situations. Don't blame this motherfucker for having all this money and you for being a fly attracted but to shit. But when you have clout and money, you should... Why would you want to go with a 15-year-old just fuck someone older? No, 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 you're taking our conversation back. How on earth are you defending We just came a step forward further from that. We understand that taking advantage of kids is not a conversation we're having. We uh -huh. know that's wrong. That's not uh -huh. what we're talking about. But can we take about. that out of the R. Kelly conversation? That, that has to be a part of the conversation. It's part of the conversation. It's yeah. not out of it. We're saying R. Kelly is... He is, if he's done that, he's done. He's had sex with a 14-year-old. Mm -hmm. Abomination. Okay. In addition to that, though, because the, the special is not just one girl. As a matter of fact, the special is not about the wrong things he did. The special is about how these girls felt bad about him. Because when you look at the wrong things he did, I can only find, based on what I have heard, and mind you, I haven't worked, watched the special, giving, transmitting sexual... Sexually transmitted diseases Called to people destiny. who don't know is bad. Sexual destiny. underage girls is bad. But tell me, bitch, you can't this. leave my motherfucking house until I tell you so, and the door is I wide open, but destiny, she doesn't leave. Bro. Listen, that just happens when you're fucking under the impression, and it happens to all of us. When you work at a job and the manager manager tells you some wrong shit to do, sometimes you do it, even though you know it's wrong. Mm -hmm. Why? Because you want to keep your job. Same thing as when you're dick sucking. It's still a scummy thing to do on his part. No shit. Yeah. How many times a manager told you to do the wrong thing and they know it's wrong, but they make you do it anywhere just because they said so. Yeah. And you do it because you're the employee. But if, but I hate to get back to it, but if they were 14, then the argument is doesn't no, matter. No, of course we already went, we crossed yeah. that bridge. So, but but, we but can't the special get... is much much more than that bridge, though. Okay, we if get the, it. If the special they were all just, thoughts. We get it. We get it. If they, the special they were was just being the 14 year old, the conversation would have been a done deal already. But it, exp it extends his ex-wife is in the fucking special. What the fuck is she doing in there? Crying. Meanwhile, the next video, we see her dancing to an R. Kelly song talking about my baby daddy. Really? How does... If this guy treated... 
When I hit you, everything in me is repulsive when you show up. When I hear your song, I cringe. When they talk about you, I cringe. I'm not dancing to your song talking about, oh, that's my man. And then sitting at the next special crying talking about, you treated me so bad. I don't think, yeah, means, I don't think it means bitch. like that, Scoop, Andy, but... Great conversation. Alrighty. Destiny's on Locked the podcast. Right he's right on the podcast. He can't talk. Okay. Ibizi's like talking to a wall, they say. Uh, uh, listen, man. Alright, well, great conversation. That's That was fantastic. I'm glad we... Uh, Get to the bottom of that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad right. we got to the Perfect. bottom of I'm that. I'm just saying, man, this guy... Listen, not to mention, this started five years Leave ago. Leave your desktop. They forgot about it. Now they're bringing the story up like it happened yesterday. What's up, bro? Okay, one more thing. Okay. The wallet, the condom in the wallet is gone. Scam my last donor watch what? clip. They always meme saying I have the condom in my wallet. It's gone. Why? Because I don't use condoms anymore. Why is your sister at least a little bit? Why? EBZ, are you well, high? What the fuck are you You shouldn't really about? carry one around. The girls are victims. Oh, Manager just... versus Cepito, okay, okay. You're an idiot. LOL, LOL, R. Kelly Hogg tied his wife. Look it up, smart guy. R. Kelly what? Hog tied his wife. Okay, now that's a different conversation. Yeah, that's that's a different conversation. No, no. Where is that girl? She was just at a lift period time. Hog tied his wife? Yeah. She's just at a lift period time. She was at a Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. <laughs> she's not my sister. <laughs> it looks why are you trying to hide your sister? Oh, she's not 17. Oh, that's her. <sighs> How old is she? How old is she? I don't know. 17. <laughs> that's that's what the image says. That's what it says. <laughs> oh, EBZ, bro. You're so funny. You gotta, you gotta be careful, bro. You gotta I'm be... just asking. Let me say be careful. Like, listen, I'm the most modest guy you can run into. I would not touch that bitch with a 10 foot pole. You just said you would. I gawked over it. I didn't say I would. Okay. I said, wow. Alrighty. Well, uh, <laughs> that, that was fun. I'm glad we talked a lot about it, dude. Fucking uh, EBZ, thank you for the conversation. And thank you, Gary, as well, for the conversation. Uh, no problem. Well, everybody, this is probably the first stream of the 30 days where I was excited to hit those three hours because, motherfucker, I'm so fucked up and tired today from the hangover. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm not feeling that challenge, though. I'll tell you what, I, I'm not feeling the challenge no matter what. I will bullshit my way through three hours if I really have an off day like today. I don't give a fuck, dude. <laughs> as long as I don't fail. But tomorrow we're going to be doing the, uh, the hide and seek stream, so look forward to that. Point. We're going to have money also, taked on me. I'm going to have to so run away from people. Ways, we have pepper spray. I describe. don't know what the legality Good behind shape. this is. Uh, hold on. Thank you, you dude. Is there, is there, uh, there, you should have been timed out for spamming, but I don't know. Hold on. Um, I don't know what the legality of this is, but I'm, I'm going to have pepper spray. And people who try to rip the money off me, I'm going to pepper spray. So, I mean, I don't know what the legality of that is. I might not be able to do that, but, I mean, I'll we'll see. I'll have pepper spray, dude. And I want to do, like, a thing where, you know, because I'm going to have, like, all the money on me at once. And you can rip off as much as you would like, but I will pepper spray you. And it'll be, like, $500 on me. So, you can get the whole 500 for yourself, but you're going to get a lot of pepper spray to your face. Like I said, don't know the legality of that, but, you know, we'll see. Um, okay, well, until then, I'll see you all tomorrow. EBZ streaming. Check them out. EBZ on YouTube. Fucking Ahmad can hopefully post in the chat and link it. Or IceBeside.com to check it out. Um, and yeah, I can... Uh, I'm streaming. I might be on that. We'll see. Alright, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Love you guys. Peace and...